Uh, I mean, this might be harder than a seriously run. I'm not sure. Not the game in general, but I mean doing a permadeath non-meta run. I don't know. I'm not sure. It's hard to compare. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't exactly have 3,000 hours of experience in this game. Nor do I intend to. <laughs> <laughs> Those guys you can just nudge off the edge. You can't do that to other people, I don't think. Just nudge them like that. Uh, I should try to... Try to get a kill streak going, I guess. Oh, there's a lot of dudes in there. Right, I'm not going to be able to kill them fast enough, I don't think. I see you're stuck in the web there. Crash kill later once I'm ready to go to the next floor. Three enemies die in a single explosion. Weapon this early? Oh, it's a blue. A blue um, blade, right? No, wait. No, it's the weapon. Well, I never found a blue weapon for one, I don't think. Interesting. Interesting. This is the run. I don't think it's super relevant, honestly, but. Especially since it's a sword sword, a weapon which I'm not too fond of. We got a salt wands expert as a random skill. Kinda sucks. for this five int five decks there's no way we can get that right now this one we need five int which gives us two decks actually actually I might be able to do this maybe not one off
getting uh, pretty good loot, honestly. Let's make the map bigger. Street going. Let's play a little aggressive, huh? Not sure if I can kill streak this guy. Oh yeah, we got it. Nice. <laughs> Keep the kill streak going. Oh, there's still an enemy in here somewhere. Where? No. Oh, we lost kill streak. corner somehow. Couldn't get to him over here? Uh. Okay, let's backtrack and loot. Slick moves. Yeah, that was a nice suit. Nice little streak we got there. <clears throat> it's pretty rewarding to win streak and rather challenging if you're not overpowered. Although we do have quite good gear. Like we've got a pretty good sword right now, so the sword's doing work. Okay, well. I guess I pretty much had all the loot. Oh yeah, let's not forget about kill three enemies when there's an explosion. We should look for an opportunity to do that. We actually did have a pretty easy opportunity during that kill streak. Mm. Oops. So far. Um. <laughs> Oh. That vase had three things in it. Big money. Three moles and an three moles here and explosive barrels. Should be able to pull it off here. Might get tricky. Let's hope we don't get caught. No way. <laughs> I only got two. Ah, that's still. Damn. Feels bad, man, indeed. Drop the 
the streak. Just trying to keep the streak going. We lost it there. Um, so we need four decks, five strength. I guess the life steal. I don't know what's better, five max HP or life steal. I think the max HP is actually better at this point than 0.4% life steal. I think I'll never get more than five health points from life stealing at this point. I don't think we could learn the life steal trait from that though. Not a bad idea. I should have fixed my tweaks my stats to be able to wear that. Hey, Goddeth. What's up, dude? It's turkey season in the pit. Oh, is it? <laughs> All right. So I have to keep our eyes open for explosive opportunities. An expl there's explosive barrel. I don't see two enemies in there though. Too bad. Uh, what if I can lure another one in here? Oh, I've already been in here, right? Not gonna happen right now. <coughs> cool, I could wear the blue sword, which has arachnophobia, which means we can charge wands. It's our best wand. Two charges. Okay. Oh, that might blow. I wonder if that blows up the spiders. No, it does not. Cool. So with Arachnophile, we can get uh, wand charges from eating spiders. Hmm. This way now. Any explosive barrels in here? Explosive barrels, not enough enemies though. Yay, kept my streak going. Perfect. Nice. Alright. That's the end of the streak, I'd say. It's the end of the floor, honestly. Honestly, if I'm doing farming runs, I kind of don't need to farm every square inch of the maps. 
especially since this, this is this feels like it's been a very uh, rather lucky loot run. Uh, rather lucky gear. Whoa! Don't fall in the spikes. <sighs> I don't think I've ever found a blue weapon for one. Here we are wielding a sword or a knife. Short sword. How do we get out of here? Trying to figure out which way to go. It's quite uh, quite a maze. Oh, not a maze, but it's quite a long walk. I was trying to find a short path, but I don't think there is one. That's it. <clears throat> floor two. So on this floor, because we're going to be trying to grind up meta progress for a permadeath run, we'll see. Yo, really? Caught me with my my guard down. <laughs> well, there's the shoot. So Sorry, these boots are just fine. Eventually we'll, we'll throw a bunch of potions down there, but for now, is the vendor here? Nice. Apparently the vendor is very nice. Will you kill somebody? I can help you. And the wands... Oh, we have a salt wand here. <laughs> One to two damage. I guess I just sell the wands, right? Because we're not going for the long run. And the wands aren't, aren't going to come in handy. I'm sure I got some chase up. Got a nice page for ya. Be chase got a nice page for ya. I mean, this one is kind of nice. I guess we'll keep this one. It has stats on it and also it's kind of good. <clears throat> Come here, spider. Even though we have a good blue dagger, look how freaking bad it is. 
took me forever to heal that guy. Here. Oh, Jesus. <coughs> that orb almost hit me. I hate how daggers don't interrupt them. Fucking dagger is so bad. Is there a way to turn this thing off? I don't think so. I'll loot up here anyways so that I can see. <coughs> Alright, um. Just gonna go big in intelligence right now, just cause we're farming anyways. Maybe I'm underestimating flame walk. It depends. Like the whole hit and run style, flame walking is pretty good for that. <clears throat> yeah, there's a healer somewhere. Flame walking will ignite the ignite the tar on the ground. Let's see. Okay, my steps were like right over top of it. Are you serious? I don't know. Maybe it looks like it doesn't. Maybe my steps were are hiding underneath the tar. You can't see it. The, the head knockoff trait? I got mind blast. <laughs> 20 to 26. That's probably better. <clears throat> Rivet Katane. I was kind of missing you back online. Aw. That's sweet of you, bud. for this. Gimme, 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 gimme. <laughs> Alright. Um. What are we getting there? Anything interesting? No, not really. It doesn't look like it. How come we have another copper key? I guess we missed a chest on the previous floor, maybe?
All oh, right, the freaking <laughs> I got baited by that again. The um... there's a bench blocking the spikes. So funny. Playing some pit? What run are you doing? Do I still- I do still have the explosion barrel quest, right? Yeah, so there's a barrel right there and there's a spellcaster right next to him. The spider just jumped to his death, didn't he? Um, I mean, this should do it, right? That should do it pretty easily. There we go. We got 160 bucks. Oh god, okay. Attack came in quick. <clears throat> Rick looks unbeatable for me. <laughs> With the increased food consumption, he is indeed extremely hard. I would agree. I would attest to that. Switch positions or something. Oh, the head blast one shot that guy, or maybe that was the weak one, and they switched positions when I turned around. Got a pretty good uh, kill streak gone. Fuck that guy. Uh, that guy just ruined my kill streak. Okay, he's over a pit, and I'm scared. Whatever, I'll come back to you later, I guess. Good job, spider. Get shotgun, you idiot. Okay, um... Yeah, honestly, if I'm in farm mode, let's just get a gazillion intelligence right now. Why not? Makes sense. <laughs> yeah, shoddy. I love how wands, for whatever reason, they're just like... They're they're basically like ballistic weapons. It's like every single one. Well, not every single one. Most of them are sound like a ballistic weapon. Like uh, where's oh, I sold the machine gun one. It's kind of a rare one. Um, what skills should I learn? Another life steal, a bloodlust. Bloodlust helps a little. Um, for like. 
kill runs, which is what I'm going to be doing for a while. Hmm. Sure, why not? I hear another quest giver. Did I grab? Was that on this floor I got the quest, or was that a previous floor? I don't know. Mind Blast is pretty strong early on. It looks like it has like a a base damage, right? Fifty damage. Hmm. I wonder how this scales, Mind Blast. It's kinda nice for kill streaking as well. <clears throat> Wait, am I switching to the sword or not? Yes, I'm actually switching to the sword. I'm going to have it in my toolbar. Melee speed. This is more armor and pyromancy and dexterity. Yeah, I like that better. These are just regular hammers. Change the font in this game? Yeah. I mean, I like the font here. Like down at the bottom. I'm sure it's a little hard to read, but the I mean I don't have too much of a problem with the font. It's more about the colors. Am I have I gotten used to seeing I feel like I'm having a better chance. I, I'm getting used to seeing the baby blue. Or wait. Or has it changed? Wait. Why do I feel like the... No. Oh, okay. It's because it's the background is different, right? So, like, the baby blue kind of works on a dark blue background. But on a, a brown-white background like this, it's, it's not good. Another stupid bug there. Okay. Oh, I can... I can just go crazy. How did that not hit him? I'm scared to fight bugs because you can straight up fall off of the ground. Okay, now oh, we lost the wand. It doesn't matter that much. It honestly does not matter that much. Hordes of Glory. Yeah, I think I I haven't really played it. I look at it briefly, but yeah, I, I remember having a hard time reading. Have you played a match yet of that? Sorry, if I know I was kind of planning on getting it, getting a game going, but I just kind of lost the will for whatever reason. So where to now? Um, have I been to the secret area yet? I'm right next to the vendors. Uh, you know what you start the show, so you? whatever. Keep that wand around, I guess. Great. That one's beautiful. Be safe. Crafting is near pointless right now. I could keep the good crafting materials, uh, I guess. Just like the green ones. Yes, let me take that off your hands. Be safe. 
Because we can't shoot whatever we craft anyways. Shoot and we can't shoot and reset anyways. Yeah, we can. That's actually a decent damaging one, the ice one. We'll shoot that one. Shoot the map too. Got a good channel. Yeah. Cool. You playing a uh, single player? How's the? Uh, how's? Are you playing with some folks? Treasure room. <coughs> How's the AI? Oh, I was trying to eat you. I hate how bugs can like walk under your your foot and just crush themselves. Like, I wasn't even moving and it died. <laughs> you d dumb dumb. All right, uh, where are we going now? <laughs> mind blast. Uh, good job, mind blast. Let's see if we can't keep the streak going. Alright, new quest. Uh, that quest is really hard. Uh, guess we're done here? Wait, where's the exit? Yeah, where the hell is the exit? Oh, it must be there. I think I see it. So let's go to the chute, drop uh, as many things as we can that we feel like we can, and then we'll reset on the next floor. Got a nice piece for ya. Huh. I should have kept the secondary weapon. Don't get yourself killed. I didn't shoot a weapon. Hmm. That's a bit of an oopsie, but it's okay. Lesson learned for next time. Is it worth shooting wand charge stuff? I guess. Just the low tier ones because they're more abundant. The high tier one will sell. So how many potions do we need? Let's just keep three, I guess. Keep the map. We can shoot the fire bombs too. Shoot that gear. I think I shooted some boots already. Alright. Now. I was going to shoot that, but I can't, because I can't use the sword. <laughs> that then, I guess. Now, let's hope I didn't uh, <laughs> shoot too much to the point where I'll die on the next floor. I think I'll be alright. Uh, right, so I think the exit's here. But no, it doesn't show a locked door. Oh no, the it is here. It wasn't a locked door. <clears throat> Sometimes makes uh, some suboptimal plays, but play. But overall, it's easy to lose against. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, so let's use the map. So the shoot is unfortunately way the fuck over there. All right.
tempted to just go in there. Come on, dude. He's got a what? He's got a magic sword too. Time. <laughs> I'm sure it's better than what we have, probably, because we're on a lower level. Nice kill streak, all these guys. It's good. For days and days he slept. Alright, rip kill streak. Good. 1.42 damage because of the because of the bloodlust there. Pretty good. Pretty good. Alright. Um Blue blooded and arcanist, bloodlust and thorns, more damage. Keep bloodlust. We don't really need to farm too too much here. We basically just need to reset. Don't need to farm every last inch in this place. Oh. How about we give him a fair fight, huh? Sides, it's the side attacks, I think, that give me a hard time for whatever reason. I don't know. I think. Oh, well, my third heavy pistol is really <laughs> useless. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, that sucks. Oh. Oh, he hit me. We do get hit pretty goddamn hard, so. I wonder if that trap would insta kill me. Probably not. Uh, stepping on that trap should kill him, right? It will trigger the trap over there.
afraid to run in there, not gonna lie. Oh boy. <clears throat> Seal to be safe. No reason not to be greedy with my potions. Just fighting around these traps are making me very nervous. Potions. Yeah, we might actually die here. That would be not good. It's the last room we need to clear, too. Jesus. What the? Where did that second slime come from? God, I do not like this scenario. The spider behind him. <laughs> that spider is making me so nervous. Good thing is, when that dies, it should kill the spider as well. Alright, we gotta level up too. Alright, okay. Kind of a difficult room to uh, tackle. The combination of the acid on the floor and the. Um, Now we just reset here, right? Should I keep spamming intelligence? For farming purposes, why not? Well, we'll <coughs> yeah. Alright. Let's see how this goes. So we lost 120 bucks, one strength, zero dex, four int. Those are all permanent skills, non permanent skills. One level. So we still have our bloodlust and our life. 360 bucks. We lost 111? We can really build up a pretty huge money pool as well. <laughs> yeah, environmental hazards are quite dangerous, yes. I don't know if I'd agree to say that they're more dangerous, but uh, it's pretty damn close. I will attest to that. It's mostly a combination of the two is what makes them... When enemies are fighting, when there are enemies near environmental hazards, you're just kind of... scared. There's an altar on this floor, okay. Pretty easy to kill streak when you got meta progress. That's that's the 
say something. Uh, let's see if I can't keep it going. Just double kill there. Oh, hi there. Let's try here. Oh, we lost our kill streak. From all that, and his head grew sore from the beating. He grew a great horn on his head where he was struck. And after some time, he awoke and he reached out in his torture, gripped his hand tightly, and he pulled the man to his feet. And still, the man spoke no ill of him, and that's not why. Instead, his horn was broken off and melted before his very eyes. And he was pulled upon his still an enemy here, excuse me. Seems a little buggy. <laughs> it looks so weird from <laughs> when they're their papers from out top look so funny. <laughs> Clear challenger within 30 seconds. I mean, that should be easy. Because we're over I don't know if I should be using this. Sword sword. Actually, yeah, I don't think it matters. Does it? No, a slower weapon makes more sense, right? Just more upfront damage, easier to one shot people. Want. Yeah, I guess we'll charge up this wand here. I killed that guy with a basic attack. <laughs> Alright, we got the quest completed. Okay, kill streaks done. So let's take a moment. Alright. Yeah, no more int. We'll leave the int there, right? Yeah. <laughs> 
Just beating everybody up with a giant shoe, don't mind me. The infinite shoe mace, yeah. <laughs> shoe mace is hilarious, man. Top notch. So, is there any skills we want to pick up? I don't mind one point in Arcanist, considering like enemies drop arcane ones. <laughs> Mind blasts is I don't know. I don't know how good it is. It's it's all right, honestly, I and mean, it's hilarious. Oh, this is Pyromancer. Pyromancer is also not bad. Um, once you get fiery, fiery, fiery on your on your weapon. Sure. Some health potions. This is the sacrificial sacrificial room. It's, it's, wow, I almost fell down there. Honestly, it's pretty much if we want to sacrifice. Where the hell's the exit? Oh, the I guess I didn't push the button. Yeah, I didn't push the button. That's what we did wrong. <laughs> We did kind of rush through this this room. Wait, how do I get up there? Is it over there? I think so. Wait, what? Maybe it's down below and I missed it? Yeah, okay. I've been surprised and a little concerned if it was up there. Blade, this thing, <laughs> charred katana. Ooh, a sturdy halberd. Cool. I'll take that. The shoe mace is gone, guys. I'm sorry. No more shoe mace. Okay, the rest is pretty much just vendor fodder. Oh, there's a chest there. Okay. 
Turns an item into money. Very rarely find that item. No point doing that until, uh... Might as well save this item? I don't know. I can do that on the next. I can use it on floor 3 where there's no vendor, I guess. Save the map for floor 3 so I can quickly find the, uh... The shoot. <laughs> Another altar here. We could probably donate our gems. Hmm. Well, maybe not. Save that one. Fiery blow one. I don't use ones very often, but I will admit they are quite satisfying. That is for sure. Am I getting locked in there? No. Skulls in here. Come on, dude. Get bug over there. Hmm. Ah, I don't need to ask that guy. Chopped him down from the sky. <laughs> about to level. Really need the heals. Too slow? Oh, it shouldn't be. <laughs> Another enemy in this floor, apparently. Okay. I mean, why don't I just keep stacking challenges just for a little longer? I'm just doing farming runs. Yeah, sure, why not? Don't know how many more farming runs we'll do. I'm not sure. 
At some point, I assume farming won't be viable because I won't be gaining levels anymore. I'm guessing. I don't know. There's the, the head explosion coming in hot. It's definitely pretty good early on, that's for sure, because the enemies don't have that much health. <laughs> There's the head explosion again. It's nice. It's nice. It's also not useful against every any every enemy. It looks cool as fuck. Yeah, the, it's it's a hilarious idea. That's for sure. I love it. It's a super fun skill. I might grab it just for funsies, honestly. It does kind of spook me sometimes when I don't expect it, though. I assume I'm going to get used to it, but... Come on, boys. Adaptoid. Oh, shit. Uh, uh. Okay. Oh, shit. Keep the kill streak going. Uh, yeah, I'll be right. Glad you're using it how I intended it to be used to fuck with me. Even though I'm not playing the pit, still I'm so used to that sound effect that it it works. Uh, I mean I could use a map at this point, but I don't know. We've almost explored the whole whole floor, so. Let's get him the spike, I guess. the way down. So where is the vendor? We still haven't spotted it. This looks like a good dead end. Oh, it looks like a dead end, but there's no real reason to keep the wands. Uh, fire magic wand. The damage is pretty bad. How many charges does this have? That still has quite a few charges. Um, yeah, we'll sell that one, even though it had a bunch of charges in it. It's fine. Do I sell non green gems? Yeah, we'll just keep green gems. Be safe. Is there anything I should be buying off the vendors? I don't think so. I don't think there's anything. I... Be safe. All right, so now we go to the chute. Drop uh, everything. 
Everything of value. All right, I need a backup weapon. Well, well, just basically any weapon. So hopefully, I find a weapon on the way there. Not yet. Yeah, well, shooting a weapon is not that important right now. Should I keep an invulnerability? No, no, no. We're good. I'll keep one map. I'll keep that and I'll use it on the next floor. Hmm, we can actually move this around. I like how you can interact. Can you move the map around? Oh. Ah, uh, okay. That has some use to marking like uh, secret doors. That's about it. <laughs> Didn't know you can do that. Uh, the question is, do I throw all my gear down there? I mean, I think at this point, I think I all don't have a hard time following the next floor. I don't know. Oh, well, we'll experiment, I guess, and hope we don't die. Helmet's pretty nice. Oh, the wand. There are some intricacies to doing this, for sure. And uh, the next shoot's gonna be like, uh, uh, kinda its own challenge as well. Okay, so now we can shoot the axe. <laughs> well, because permadeath, it's weird. This permadeath in this game is weird, as I've explained a lot. It's, um,. There's a... you can basically suicide yourself without uh, losing your character. You basically surrender yourself and it's as if you died. And you can only do it in specific areas. So that's basically why the shoot is useful. So you can still meta grind even in permadeath. And I think that's the way it's designed to play because playing permadeath just straight up is simply, I think, well near impossible. Not impossible, but well near impossible. Definitely beyond my skill level for at least a long, long time. Because you need to play kind of flawlessly, I think. Because, yeah. yeah, I'm like, I have two armor right now. Like, how bad is that that I have two armor? Is that going to get me killed? It might. It might. Yeah, you also keep your permanent skills. You don't learn. You don't keep the skills that you learn from leveling naturally. It resets those, which is interesting. Um, but you keep all the ones that you see with stars. So yeah. All right, let's use a map. So this shoots to my left here. I think it might be a good idea to keep a second, like any extra gear, like armor. I find I should keep an extra suit handy and a wand I'm kind of wandless right now Ugh. these green slimes are really tricky They may not seem tricky, but they are. Oh, I kept wait. I probably kept too many potions. But whatever. Okay, there's an altar here, which really doesn't help us right now. Secret door is there. Ooh, it looks like that chute might be hard to get to. It looks close, but I don't think it actually is close. <coughs>
Whoa. Ceiling's kind of working against me. Lost her mind blast. <laughs> I was looking for the head to explode. It did not. If I'm not careful, I could definitely die after throwing away all my gear. Even though I'm I'm meta progress right now. I'm not meta progress to the point where I'm like insanely strong. There's no real reason to loot right now, I guess just for gear, but... Quest giver? It's crafting. Let's pull the spider, I guess. Yeah, he hit me for forty. pretty hard. <laughs> Holy shit, those things fly. The fuck? Plus side, I don't need to worry about my potions count, but it's good that I brought a little extra ones. Some, albeit by accident. I get locked up in here now. What was that? A hilt. Huh, I could actually make a... Make a sword if I needed to. Well, the smithy is over there. Downside is it's a dagger. I'm not too fond of. But it does hit harder than the sword. Right? Uh, 26 to 32. Yeah, it's faster and hits more. Kind of makes sense to use it. Smith is over here. Small detour. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, let's go craft it real fast. Like, this is another font. Look at this orange on white. Like, I can't fucking read that thing. Not for the life of me.
<laughs> like it's like it's like like how ugly it is. It's like a fucking piece of wood. <laughs> Alright, uh so we did open the secret chamber here, so let's have a look. Oh no I didn't. The button was right ahead. God damn, should have pushed the button first. <laughs> If I may, yep, it looks awful. Yeah, we didn't bother like making it look nice either, because we don't really care. I mean, but there is no making this look nice, is there? I should push this button. That might actually lead to the shoot, so let's go have a look. Guess I'll. Wait, why am I even doing this? Even if I find it, there's like nothing to find because I can't shoot. Anyways, I mean, there's gear, there's armor, of course. So being naked is feasible, but I still need to be quite careful. In the future, I should try to not throw away all my arm armor. Oh, I did get locked in here? Uh-oh. Uh, this worries me. Better twenty six thirty four. No, not well. Hmm, actually, it kind of is. Doesn't look god awful either. Hmm. So four decks did not give me one armor, any armor at all. I mean, I guess it's percentage based on your current armor. So because we only have two armor, it doesn't do anything. I was curious about that. Okay, we made it to the shoot. It seems. Get banned. Yeah. Get him, mods. Oh, I have a skill point. Hmm. Probably should have thought of what to spend it on before. I can just do a second life steal, I guess. I really don't know how viable that the life steal is going to be. Sustain does help, so that's for sure. So now we're level six. I wonder if like how many levels we could actually grind. Oh yeah. Other channels? Benzin, no. <laughs> Shot that guy. So at this point, if we're feeling ballsy, we could try to make it to the shoot on floor five. Hmm. We'll cross that bridge when we get there, but let's keep that on the back of our mind. But that doesn't even help us, right? 
mean, it helps us gain XP. Kaboom! This the bonus at the last second. <clears throat> I mean, I don't know. It's kind of gives them lot something to do, you know. <laughs> and it's I, don't know, I get I get like one a day, tops, maybe two, three. What's that orb? What, what? Yeah, what are purple orbs? I don't remember what those do. Have I ever seen that? Have an enemy burned to death. Oh, I've never gotten that quest. Uh, I'm guessing you only get it if you have Pyromancer. Burn to death, huh? So the only benefit I have of... Let me think about this. Going to floor 5 is XP grind, of course. Um, on floor 4, I can throw stuff down the chute as well but I need to be careful because it's right before the boss fight hmm. that's a little sketch Miguel it's randomly generated I think <laughs> Miguel I have an enemy burning us, so we don't have any fire damage. There's a fire bomb, but I think that just straight up kills them. I don't think small chance of setting them on fire. That's a nice amulet. We should shoot that one. For days and days he slept, and when he finally awoke, he looked up and his gaze fell upon a figure in the mist. That figure extended his hand, and as a man reached out to grasp it, he was struck down and back to sleep. I'm on floor one? That's on floor two, sir. Yeah, I'm on floor one. So the vendor's not on this floor, so we don't need this stuff. What the fuck are you doing in here? Where'd that guy come from? And after some time. He woke and he reached out and his torture gripped his hand tightly. Um, this wand is... Okay, we have a fire wand, so we should try to... burn an enemy to death. Get the quest. New enemy? Uh, that enemy here? No, he's... Always on floor one. He's a floor one because boss. See, Basically, the idea of this enemy, it's a pretty devotion. smart of the developer, is to teach you that spikes are OP. And you should use spikes all the time. Because <laughs> that's the only way to kill him. He's impervious to all damage. Uh, do I just leave here? Yeah, I just go to the second floor right now. Right? Yeah, there's no reason to stick around here. Ooh. I should have stocked up on loot, though, to sell. I think I forgot to do that. Yeah. Oh. Kind of a big deal, but kind of not. Hmm. I guess I should start do, trying to do that quest, huh? Ah, not this guy. I got nowhere to run, so... Just letting this guy hit me. 
don't care. Thirty-six percent chance. One in three. Oh, he's burning. Are you gonna die from it? That's the tricky part. Nope. Oh, he's burning. Yay! You got gourmet. <laughs> I did not do that on purpose. <laughs> did not even realize I was there. That last floor had that purple orb too. I should have tried to get that purple orb. I actually don't remember what that does. If I've ever even seen it before. Explosion! Bye bye. Is there a hole down there? No. Okay. stuff at them yeah I mean well it w I didn't throw something at them it was a kinetic wand you can only throw stuff at them with the kinetic wand <sighs> and you can only throw certain things unless you're specced into kinetic magic and then you can throw bigger stuff yeah <laughs> it, it was very effective though you're right on that So I think Action I've been, I've been kind of like skipping loot a lot. No, maybe not. No. Careful. How weird is it I've done all these runs and I don't think I've ever found a chess piece. 
kind of weird. Boys. Oh, there's a chess piece. <laughs> Complain, and you get what you want. Good lesson in life. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Why is this? Oh, cursed shaft. I wonder if we're getting close to the point where we can't progress our levels. Because basically I need to get two levels by the time I hit floor three. Looks like I'm not getting that. No one can read your mind. Are you sure about that? a healer so let's try to just one-shot these guys <laughs> nice I kept the kill streak up the end of my kill streak. <clears throat> There's the shoot. Treasure room. I also don't know if her money's been going up. I'm not sure. I think I like the plus one dex. Huh. Plus one dex is not giving us any armor at 52. That's a little bit of a surprise. Chance to... 4.5 chance to crit. Yeah, half a percent per dexterity for crit. Which is pretty decent. I'm surprised I'm not getting armor though. From the decks. Armor effectiveness. Maybe it says armor effectiveness. Maybe it's not armor. Maybe it's some sort of hidden percentage. You'd have to get an item that gives a lot of decks to maybe check it. <laughs> the baby won't get feed, huh? <laughs> That's funny. Alright, we shaft a few things here. These extra pair of gloves.
crafting materials that seem to be... Is this any good? Yeah, it's, it's not bad. Have I been in here yet? Nope, just got locked in. There's a healer somewhere. Up there. Come to the head! Aw. Mm, this is a bit of a conundrum, honestly. a halberd. It actually hits harder by a lot. So we should actually, even though it's not green, should switch to that. <laughs> Cherry pie. <laughs> Sounds like a good break fast to me. Now the helmet should pick it up. Again, like having uh, backup gear, if I'm going to shoot a whole bunch of stuff, is kind of a good idea. This guy was gonna get me. But we're good. Okay. Where's the exit? Sure, where the exit is. Oh, in this corner here? Maybe? No? Hmm. Got weapons, armor, all the great. Uh, should probably shoot a weapon. Shooter headpiece. We need to keep pretty much all the yeah, armor. Take that off your hands. A shaft. It's whatever. We'll shoot that. Sell that, I guess. See ya. Do you want to sell something? Do you want to sell something? <laughs> <laughs> 
Don't get killed. So, yeah, where the fuck is the exit? Oh, over there, I bet. Yeah, okay. Maybe. So we can consider if we feel like we can push to floor five. I don't know. I honestly don't feel strong enough. Guess I'll do one more farming. So, am I going to get two levels here? Yeah, so... I need to gain two levels, I think, to progress in levels. Alright. Ah, uh, the gloves. The chest piece, I guess, will shoot it? Or should I just keep it? Shoot it. <clears throat> well, it's not spectacular. How many potions do I want to keep on me? Four? Five? Let's say five. I guess. <laughs> I guess I'll throw the Gobra Gee down there. Um. Right, I still don't know where the exit is. I'm suspecting it's at the end of this hall. Yeah. What's that noise? Okay. Is this stuff spontaneously combusting? Yeah, we won't go spider boss yet. We'll do... This will be a last farming run, and we'll progress to floor 5. Hopefully, we'll see how that goes. Want to sew something? Have a bit of a co. Are you, are you imitating the? Uh, are you imitating the mole salesman? The mole salesman's kind of awesome. Oh shit! I was not able to hit the spider twice. The axe. Block that. Came out fucking around. No explodey head. Uh, yeah, slightly less damage, but it's, it's a sword, so.
<clears throat> okay. He's pretty cool. Yeah, the shotgun is pretty cool. As opposed to... Oh, there's a shoot already. So we just take it, right? There's no reason to... Well... I should probably try to farm a level. Right? Farming a level makes sense. I'm a little spooked to do that because we're, we're like pretty much naked. But anyways, let's clear the way to the uh, chute. And we'll see where that goes. Uh, we'll get locked up in here. I don't know if they'll charge me. Doesn't look like it. Guess we're going in. He was like stuck in his travel time and yeah, hit me. Okay. Shouldn't get locked up in here. Did I shoot the map? I don't know. <clears throat> I was supposed to use a map on this floor, but whatever. Oh, there's a couple baddies over there. That's good. Perma stats are good. Can I turn this thing off? Get this uh, warrior's attention here.
We got our level. It's good. And we're at the shoot, I think. Are we? The hell is it? Oh yeah, I see it. I see it. Skill points. Um, Man of Steel, Gourmet. I mean, Gourmet, I think one point in Gourmet is probably worth it. Ooh, fire damage. Yeah, I want that, actually. Nice. That's a good, that's a good find. I'm going to get that. Stats, I don't know if it matters that much. Probably does to do it before I reset. Um... For a few seconds. Yeah, I'm aware of that, Stufus. I just... Instead of hitting him with the sack, I just interrupt them with power attacks. Power attacks. Interrupt them unless you're very weak, I think. Lost two levels. So actually, I'm not progressing in levels anymore. So... I'm kind of hard. You're kind of hard capped at this level unless you do some really crazy shenanigans, uh, kill streak shenanigans. Huh. So I guess that's a sign that we should progress. So interesting. Hmm. We got four hundred bucks. The gold is going up though, but. The big thing is the consumables, honestly. <sighs> yeah, looks like we're ready to try to progress here. We'll try to get the floor five now. For how many runs we did, we don't have that much stuff. I mean, we got gear. The gear is looking, you know, all right. For sure. Weapon seems a little weak, but... Alright. It's nice that we have a fiery weapon now. Definitely a bonus. Let's see if we can't get a kill streak going. Apparently not, because... Oh. <laughs> Have three enemies killed, an explosion. Alright. Oh, we got a kinetic wand. Cute. Useful, 
Divine Mobility. I guess I'll take it. So times three is the cap for a kill streak. All right, we just lost it here, I think. Yeah. All right, not bad though. Not bad at all. Got tons of XP there. Chess piece. Uh, well, is it? I lose three armor, but I get blue blooded. Blue blood is not the worst thing. I'll grab it, I guess. Probably don't need to farm this for one. I think we'll be all right. As is. Grab some some stuff we can vendor. I don't know why I'm being so defensive on 4 1, but. Mm, it's kind of whatever. Got the medic PBA on Merc. Feels bad, man. Is that human only? I, be, I, I guess so, right? Yeah, well, of course it is. Of course it is. Sad day. Oh. Okay, still took a beating even though... Oh, we are on floor 2 now, right? Vendors here, which is nice. Need a weapon. So what's our plan here? Um, we're gonna progress to floor on floor four. We're going to shoot what we can, and on floor five we'll reset. I think that's the plan. Lack of pace. You know, I won't use that myself. No reason to have two copper keys, but whatever. Don't get yourself killed. What do you need? Be safe. Just drop this one here for now. Need a weapon? Yeah, I do, huh? Dude, this weapon's probably better, isn't it? 15, 17, uh, not really. 
I don't it's faster, it's but it's pretty close. <laughs> that room looks a little weird. I've never seen this like Stonehenge building there. Axe head. Find a shaft. We can make that on four three. Yeah, I've never seen this before, I don't think. Hmm, interesting. is better, right? Yeah, that's for sure. Oh. I guess this would be a good time to, to try the, the new mark map marking function we found. Three enemies die in explosion. That's something I haven't been thinking about. There's a barrel there. I should think about completing that quest. Oh, there's an enemy there. Is there a barrel in there? There's no barrel in there. I can maybe lure three of these guys here back over there. Be tricky, but. Oh, that guy spotted me. Let's get his attention. I have that guy's attention. There they come. Uh, I think I only got. <laughs> I got one. Oh, we tried. If that counts as an explosion, it might actually. Yo, you're doing the merchant voice. Need a weapon? <laughs> Got a laser carbine and a shotgun for floor 10. Ah, yeah. Looks good. Good start. Are you playing. Uh, what difficulty are you playing on, Benson? Better gloves. A ring. I don't think we have a ring yet. Melee crit versus melee crit. <laughs> okay. Mm. Now nah, we won't use the mace. Don't need that either. Actually, well, might as well carry it. There's a vendor on this floor, by the way. Might as well do a vendor run right now. Oh, I haven't been in here yet. 
Look at that AI pattern. Spectacular. There's another guy over there. I've gotta keep my kill streak. <laughs> that head get him? They did get him. <laughs> nice. Right. I lopped his head from here. Fucking woo! It's beautiful. It was boobiful, let me tell you. Right, I was doing a vendor run, but actually, I think I have to actually go this way. It's not really a vendor run, it's more of a... Do you want to sell something? It's more of a, I gotta go. Do you want to sell something? <laughs> We're not shooting stuff yet, right? No, we don't need to worry about shooting stuff right now. We're gonna shoot stuff on floor four. So that's when we can start collecting stuff. <clears throat> Okay. Be safe. That's it. Can drop a few things here if I really wanted to, but yeah. Just drop the wand is fine. Yeah, that's it. Duh. No, we have to come back that way later. Right. I'm rambling a little. Hope you guys don't mind. Not really, not really explaining my thought process <laughs> super clearly. Shoot. Wow, I killed him so fast. Weird. Keys in here. <laughs> it's very fun to kill him that way. <clears throat> I think we got a shaft for the axe now. Nice. Killed all three of those bugs without getting hit. Kind of impressive. It's really hard to not get hit by those bugs. If only I can do that when it really mattered. Because right, I'm like at full health. There's health everywhere. Did I turn that crank? I don't remember if I turned the crank. Yeah, I did. Alright. 
All right, so we're pretty much done here. So, and do I want to shoot anything right now? Um, what am I about this enchantment? I don't know. Four armor or ranged crit? Definitely four armor. I yeah, might as well shoot this stuff, right? I think that's it, though. Not the consumables. Temporary tattoos. <laughs> oh, yeah, much to vendor right now. Do you want to say something? Not much right now, friend. Go, go, old tiger. So I'm glad. Like, so marking that spot is I was actually kind of useful. Surprisingly enough, it's gonna it's just gonna remind me. Otherwise, I would have had a kind of a hard time. Um, Finding it. Remembering that I had to go there. <clears throat> There's the key. Can't handle those moving corpses? <laughs> you mean like the billboarding as they say? <sighs> Alright, so we're done here. Um, should be some loot to pick up. This. Oh, I haven't been in here yet. Grab his wand? No, I did not. <coughs> We're all done here? I think so. I'm watching that room. Hmm. I guess there, uh, there really isn't that much loot to pick up. I thought there was more. Either that or I'm missing it. Maybe one of those other rooms over here. That corner room, probably. Take a quick peek there. No? It's not. Yeah, you mean this? Yeah. That. <laughs> it's pretty old school, I tell you. I got some good ones there. Uh, do we sell the wands? Yeah, I just sell the wands. Well, well, the the standard ones. Keep those. Safe. The fire one, and whatnot. So yeah, we can make an axe on the next floor. 36. Yeah, it's actually going to be a pretty big upgrade. Where are our maps, by the way? 
Did I accidentally sell them? Or it's kind of weird. Huh. Huh. Should I enchant something? Is there something I feel like I'm going to have for a while? Hmm. I can enchant like the ring. We're not going to be able to shoot any of the spider gear because there won't be a uh, shoot after it. Um, I kind of feel like I should just use this now. I still haven't completed this quest, too. Just put on that ring. It's fine. Okay, we're out of here. Oh, right, we don't shoot anything. We don't need to shoot anything. We'll shoot something at on floor, the next floor. So we need to think about collecting maybe a second set of armor. <clears throat> Jesus, I'm trying to figure out. Oh, yeah, this is like a very roundabout way of going where I need to go. There we go. Right. <laughs> should be a better axe. Nice that the first guy we fought dropped stuff for us. Passageway. We don't need to mark that though. When you do unlock the passageway, it just shows up on the map on its own. Well, wow. aggro range. Oh boy. going on by the way the drobe how's it going so we're not gonna prisoner shoot at this time so that means we're gonna try to progress a little oh we got locked in shit huh. <laughs> hey we leveled up <laughs> well timed Leproy. I think that was random that you did that, but... Yeah, we got double explosion kill. It's too bad we didn't get the triple. Too bad we didn't get the triple. Max strength at this point? Nah. Got a new skill point. I wish it would so show like the next level, like the per like from this level to the next, but it doesn't. So we can do something like uh, fiery blows, life steal. Let's keep keep going on life steal. I think 0.5 percent that time. I have waited the whole seventh level. <laughs> it was very well timed, very good. Uh, 
That is a smithing area if you want to make that axe. Let's see, this axe 28 to 48. This one is yeah, considerably better. Should I just make it now or should I wait? So if I wait, I might find better mods. I do have two mods anyways. It's a thin handle for an axe? Nah, nah, nah. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, let's just do this now. Beautiful. Thin is the name of the eggs. Seventeen armor. It's definitely an upgrade. Uh, actually, let's hold on to that axe. I might want to shoot it. For some reason, I don't. No, oh, we'll definitely find. Some. Oh no, we'll hold on to it actually. It's possible we don't find anything better to shoot. <coughs> Alright, so here's our chance to do the triple kill. Ooh, um, ah, oh, jeez. <gasps> How do we do that? It sounds, it seems so risky, but. Especially with that damn spider. That spider is going to be too hard to. Actually, let's. Ah, uh, boy. I don't know. This is this is sketch. If I can get that guy's attention at the end of the hall, maybe we can pull it off. So let's uh, get this guy stuck in the tar for a second. <clears throat> I don't think I can reach with the shotgun. Oh, there. I got his attention. Oh, I think I hit the barrel. Did I? Yeah. I hit the barrel with the shotgun. Wand. Not what I intended to do, but oh well. Hope so, I just crafted it. Drop that though. Melee and no, life. It's got really good traits on it. But I guess so does this. Yeah. It's got intelligence on it as well. It says more intelligence on it. 30 to 40. It's close. It's definitely close, so. I was worried about that. I like didn't aim anywhere near it, but <laughs> still caught fire. So there's some explosive barrels in here. We can still try to do the quest, given the opportunity. <laughs> the Dark Messiah joke. Let's see if we can't pull anything off with this. So one dude there. I can get a bunch of dudes stuck in the web, maybe. I don't know if that's a thing, honestly. Never tried doing that. It's gonna be tough to get the mole man stuck in the web, but this fucking crate is pissing me off. Crate's out of the way now. Let's lure him over here. Oh. Okay. Goddamn crate. Alright. I get past this guy. Okay. Let's see if he'll. Alright. 
Well, that's one good way to do it. <laughs> Just need to get one more, one more enemy stuck in our spider web. Uh, green items, huh? I might want to shoot this sword. Same with this armor. Not really anything we want to donate here. Not yet, anyways. All right, just gotta lure one more enemy. We're getting kind of far away from our goal here. All right, come here, bub. Can you sack them into the web? Probably, I might have to do that here. I think the green goblin dudes are smart enough to not walk into the web. I'm like, that guy spawned in the web, so we're fine, but. Oh no, they're dumb. Nice. Oh, this is a cool way of doing this quest. Let's see, I thought of this before. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, we got him, but. <laughs> oh, I didn't see what the reward was. Anybody catch that? So, we, what happened there? The barrel touched the. Thing, I guess and broke it <coughs> I don't know what the reward was <coughs> stat points oh yeah it's that point you are correct All right, we have a whole bunch of swords. It's the best one. 30 to 41. Yeah. Any talents we want to keep around here? Arcanist is a decent talent, but I don't think I want to carry that around. These will keep the shoot. I don't really like these sticky bombs too much. Yeah, I would much rather have a shot of invulnerability, absolutely. Where's the trigger for this trap? Oh, it's right there. <sighs> All right. Oh boy. Just be aggressive here. Don't get trapped in there. I hear skulls. Are you guys gonna charge at me? No? I heard the second one charging, so I didn't want to go in for the first one. Pretty strong now, that's for sure. There's no doubt about that. Can I disable this shit? Uh, don't see it. It's not really bothering us too much. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, fuck. Excuse me? I just saw the thing here next to it. There we go. 
I kind of randomly just ended up here. I kind of want to get rid of that wand anyways. Wow, they charge you from a mile away. No, they... they usually, they, I thought they shoot at you when they're that far away. Okay. Tricky room. We handled it well enough until... We got hit by... God, there's a lot of enemies in this room. Could just leave for the next floor. I'd rather clear a little more though. Get shotgunned. I didn't mean to set it on fire, but... Hey, when they're bugged out like that, it just makes me ner It's another one. Holy shit. So many. Absolutely terrifying. They're easy monsters, but they're still terrifying. <laughs> Alright. Been here already. Alright, I think it's time to go. Yeah. Alright, spider boss time. Should be easy. Barring any huge mistakes. Depends on how much stuff we shoot as well. Because we might shoot some of our good gear, because, yeah, we're resetting after this floor. At least that's my plan. It's always a pleasure. That's a great piece. Yeah, good piece. See ya. So can I, can I afford to shoot my good armor? Yeah, I can shoot that. Shoot my ring too. Yeah. The rest of the stuff I keep.
There's also the potion question, right? How many potions do I think I need to get to the shoot on the next floor? Probably not that many. Ten? Eleven? Shoot the kinetic rod. I won't need all these fire bombs, that's for sure. Three should be fine. Shoot all those. Need a weapon. So I could consider buying something and shooting it. It's a pretty good consideration. <laughs> what the hell? This wand is a fork. Awesome. That's forked up, man. Yeah, buying something just to shoot it is kind of a good idea. Plus 10 dexterity? Excuse me? Huh. Wow. I don't think I've ever seen something with so much stats on it. I might buy that. Shoot it. Alright. Seems... I don't really like the stats on it. I mean the traits on it too much. I'll shoot that. What else would I want to shoot? That's it. And there's a deflect. I do like deflect a lot. I want to learn deflect. I should just buy these and then learn deflect. Yeah, that's a good idea. Don't get killed. And we could. Uh, we don't need to shoot these. They're both shoulder armors. Yeah. So Hello. Sell that. So do you have to pick up everything on your next character? Or can you leave stuff behind for another one? I don't quite get what you're saying, but if you put something to shoot... If you, you do a die or do a permadeath suicide or permadeath reset, you'll get all the gear when you start it. All right, I think that's good. Do I feel comfortable with 11 potions? Mildly comfortable. Let's make it a, let's make it a dozen. All right. As long as we don't die in the boss here, we'll be okay. I think we're gonna wreck this boss. I don't think we're gonna have any problems unless we make a pretty big mistake. <laughs> Fucking miss both of those shots. Alright, good. 
Good stuff. Speaking of what the drove said, always looking at you. <laughs> You're supposed to be dead. Uh, it's weak versus its own acid. Yeah, it's weird. But thank God, because he's almost this boss would be almost impossible without that <laughs> that mechanic. It would be super duper hard. Let's just say that. All right, let's take a look at what we picked up here. Uh, this axe is probably better. Oh yeah, way better. It's like double damage. Oh, it has deflect on it. <laughs> it's kind of funny. We just bought these just for deflect. Boots. Okay. Got a headpiece. Wow. Nice headpiece. If you don't pick up gear, you shoot on your next character, does it go away? Oh. Um. Yeah, probably. <clears throat> don't know for sure, but probably. I mean, you kind of have to open that chest because you can't fight without a weapon. And unless you go and find a weapon that's lying around, I don't even know if that's possible. No, it's not really possible, so. Yeah. As soon as you open the, sh the shoot, you're, you lose your stuff, for sure. Most certainly. So we have found a hilt and a shaft. I mean, if we're feeling really strong, we could think about pushing further, but that's pushing our luck. We'll see how floor five goes. No problem, Derek. No problemo. Hey, boy. Fucking biome, it's so much harder than the one we just did, friends. Let me tell you. Wait, really? Oh, it started there. I was expecting it to come from down there. Try to eat the corpse and miss my chance. Did I see a grub here? I did. <laughs> Bug right there. Uh, does it tell you if you get locked in in this biome? I think it does. So it looks like we're not getting locked in here. pick up here oh yeah amulet lifesteal oh we got rid of our amulet and our ring and we shooted them both okay one of four so yeah there's a shoot over there see I don't know when the next reset point was or so that's the big risk now we're on uncharted territory flying enemy gets hurt by spikes well they back into it because they you know, I don't know, it makes sense to me. You can knock them back into it. Uh, 
Where are we going here? On the right? Skulls. See if I can't lure a skull out here. I'm not sure if I can. Sort of. I don't like this tire on fire. It's making me nervous. I should be able to get that skull. Ah. Tricky to, to mine the skulls and him. <laughs> Holy fuck. See how much damage you took there? Fuck. I didn't think I was gonna get hit by the uh, skulls there. Ouch. Half my health, one hit. Wow. We, we are not strong. Crazy. Crazy. So even, even farming to our heart's content has put us in a pretty tough spot. <clears throat> okay. Da, 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 da. Definitely want a potion to stay healthy. I heard of those things hitting me, man. How much spikes do you want on this floor? A lot. This room looks very similar to the one we just did, huh? Skulls and a mage. How are we gonna do this? I should be going towards the chute. I don't know why I'm going this way, right? I'm, well, I might have to go this way. I think the skull's coming. Oh, I have power blows? Hold on here. This is... Hold the attack button to charge your next swing. Charge swings. Oh, so I have like... I didn't know that's how heavy blows work. So I have like a second... Heavy... Heavy... An ultra heavy. Oh, cool. Actually never did that. It's similar to Whirlwind Strike. Thought I'd be able to swing underneath it, but almost died there. It's crazy how quickly the uh, game scales in difficulty, or in levels, or something. Well, difficulty. Okay, can you like fucking move? I'm trying to get that gold. I don't even know if this is possible. Yeah, it is. <laughs> ah, that's <was> frustrating. <laughs> I 
down to five pots. <laughs> Did we shoot too hard? I don't know. There's a door here. Wait, what? Why does it say there's a door here? <laughs> Weird. Maybe it's a secret door of some sort? I don't know. Harder do these heavy blows hit, anyways? Here's slime. Let's make sure we're careful here. 10%. <clears throat> it's nothing crazy. <laughs> wow, big crit. 500 damage. <laughs> It's Pyromancer. It's fine. 78 to 140. Some more damage. Let's not forget I have Deflect now. Right? Gotta get used to using that, right? Yeah. Did I learn it yet? No, I didn't learn it yet. Fuck. It would be really nice to learn it. But I think I threw... S no, I didn't throw the Deflect stuff in there. God, it'd be nice to level one more time, but I don't know. Might not. That might be too greedy. That slime explosion could have killed me. <clears throat> ah, didn't mean to eat that second corpse. All right, should get locked in here, but. We're okay at this point. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I 
Come here, blue boy. What's up, yummy gummies? Looks familiar indeed. Alright, let's go see what that machinery did. Where's my power attack? Oh, whatever. You do smack really hard. You do go down fast, though. Yeah, if I can get one level on this floor, I'd be pretty happy. I don't know if I will, though. I don't know if I'll be able to. One, two... Spikes. No. Just trying to like look around the corner. Should be able to look safely like this. Yeah, there's a bug there. Um, let's see if there's another way around. Say, so, second time I see the purple orb. I don't know what those do. I'm actually, I'm not sure. So. Hmm. Hmm. Another room that I'd like to approach from a different angle. Let's see if that is an option. Alright, the invisible door. What the hell's going on with that door? It's so strange. I think it... Okay, it must be like up here on the next floor. I think that's what it is. Alright, so we're out of options as far as to where we have to go. It's going to be one of these two rooms. I don't like that. I don't like that room period honestly. Oh, hello. I do have Arcanist. Almost out of, pretty much out of wands. Got one wand charge left. I'm not gonna bother trying to pick that up. This is how my last run ended, so I'm gonna jump on there, knock him down, and then come back. Yeah, we'll take shit, sir. Should die eventually. It takes them a long time to die, honestly. I don't know why it takes them so long. Sometimes they seem to not take spike damage for whatever reason. I'm waiting for him to die before I think about going in there. Also, trying to lure some skulls over here. Don't seem to be biting though. Oh, there's one. 
was like, I'm not dead yet. What the fuck? Dude, will you die? What the fuck? How long it takes? I'm starting to wonder if he's healing somehow. He shouldn't be. There's only one skull left. this at all just with so little room to maneuver it's so difficult all right. we got her done so where is that door the door is right there yeah okay what's going on here have I been here yeah it's right here all right There's a spiking wall. There'll be bugs in here, yeah. Ouch. What happened there? The floor? Floor damage? Yeah. So there's a roof that's coming down to kill me is why this room is so spooky. As you can imagine. Alright, well. Alright, anything good down there? I don't think so. Pretty garbage stiff. That's, this is kind of nice, this hilt. It's not going to help us because we're going to be resetting though. Still's definitely useful now. It feels like it's helping us sustain. Guess we're going in there now. second barrel kind of spooked me uh, the triple barrel didn't spook me though <clears throat> looks like he ignores spike damage out of combat or maybe he was casting something when looking down I don't know it's very strange to say the least okay he did not go where I expected him to go Uh, 
<gasps> we do take down enemies at a pretty fast rate. So that's positive. The wand is kind of welcome. How'd that guy die? That's a good question, isn't it? 19 armor, alright. That's better. And we could go make a weapon. It doesn't really matter. Cause I'm pretty sure we're resetting on this on this floor. I don't feel I feel like I need to try to power up. I would love to level up, but I don't think that's gonna happen though. Well, it'll be an accomplishment anyways, or you know, not accomplishment, but progress if we get to that shoot anyways. I don't know how to get to it though. Guess it's around the other side. I also don't know what these purple orbs do. What do you guys think that does? Experience? I bet it's experience actually. Maybe that'll level us. Hmm. It's the color of my experience bar. I bet it's experience. Yeah. Thousand. I don't know if that'll be enough. Never seen those before. I wonder if that's a hardcore uh, permadeath thing. Uh, so we want to go this way or this way. Did I get all the sconces? I did, right? I could craft something if I feel like it. Oh, we have artisan apparently. Might as well. We're resetting, but still. I think this is a very strong weapon. Reset! Two hundred to two sixty three damage. <laughs> the damage is real. Let's see how hard this hits. Pretty fucking hard. do need to level it's not gonna happen though I don't need to but because if I don't level I don't know if I'm getting level progress it's also the fact that I get a skill point and I'd be able to learn deflect which is a big deal uh have I been in here already uh, oh I missed oh geez I could have did this a while back I guess I wanted to see so I guess we're not going to the next floor.
I don't feel confident. I don't have that many potions. Yeah, so I have to take this. Yeah, down we go. Yeah. Two levels, yeah. Level seven? Were we level six or were we actually level seven? So what progress did we even make there? I'm not sure. I mean, the gear is one progress. And uh, stacking up on potions is another. Yeah, we bought this shoulder piece. So that's one thing. Where's my ring? Okay, it's there. <laughs> this ring's enchanted, so it's kind of a big deal. <sighs> a little spook there. So like 12 health potions? Like it's not a crazy amount. And I couldn't really throw in more health potions down the chute. Um, it was would have been really risky. I could have thrown in maybe a couple more, but even then. Risky. Oh, I didn't throw a headpiece down? Hmm. More boots? Or am I missing them? Or is there a limited amount of items you can throw? I don't think it's limited, to be surprised. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like we didn't progress much there, as far as being stronger. Maybe I'm wrong, though. The shoulder piece is huge, like massive. Hmm. So dexterity doesn't seem like it adds directly to your armor value. I wonder how it works. It says armor effectiveness. I'm really curious how that works. All right, well, let's go. Try to get a kill streak going. So what's that? Oh, it's his head. No, why are you so far away? Oh, I wore off right at the last second. Here comes the army. Damn. If we could have kept their streak going, it would have been pretty good. Alright. There's no way we're going to continue our streak. Because we're, um... There's no enemies for a while. So the potions you find seem to be, like, based on your level. Which is interesting. Because we're not finding the lowest tier potions, even though we're on floor one. We're finding the second lowest tier potions. Yeah, I would have loved to picked up deflect. It sucks that we don't we don't have it. Post, yeah. Deflect is a, a really big deal. Hey, muffin, what's going on? Muffin to puffin. <laughs> Wait, we we didn't th oh, we didn't throw down a couple vulnerable invulnerable potions, so that was a mistake.
big old streak. Oh, it fell off there. It fell off at the end there. Fast boys. Yeah. Fuck ton of XP for doing this though, huh? <laughs> All right. Should probably just leave at this point. Boots and gloves. Okay. Want to save this talent point, or is there something I like? I should probably save it for. I really want to find deflect, right? So I should probably wait until after I kill Spider Boss to use this. <laughs> really throws you, yeah. Why have I been out of here? Three hours. We'll do one more floor, I think. Quest. Single explosion. Alright, so let's keep our eyes open for an explosive barrel. Loot. Loot that we don't really care about. So I use a map here to find the vendor ASAP. Kind of. It's just yeah. Let's do it. Wait, what? Oh, he's way over there. <laughs> Shit, <It> sucks. <laughs> Do uh, a run around later on to just gather all the loot and sell it. Do it later. Does he not see me? Why is he? Why is he not moving? I don't get it. <laughs> healer guy. Let's take care of the healer guy first, shall we? Wait, where is he? All right. Sp spiking it is. Now.
that's the end of the streak. Let's go back in this room. And... Can I turn off these darn traps? really do much damage right now so it's kind of whatever but <clears throat> yeah, there it is I took one straight to the face and it felt good. <laughs> I love it. One, two, there's three guys in there. I can get them all stuck on the web, I guess. It'd be the easiest way to do it. Oh, okay. Rip, rip that idea. Try to get the caster as well. Oh, there's another web here. Okay. Confident Bulawa. New skill gain. Alright. Why kill three when you can kill four? Did it give me? Oh, it gave me this weapon, I think, that fell on the ground. Yeah. Huh. No, it's, it's a mace. It's not better than what I have. Um, one in, three strength. Well, I think I've been progressing in stats. Maybe not in levels. Yeah, maybe we can try to progress further this run. We'll see. Stat point, huh? Yeah, I was saying I want to save it for... To hopefully deflect. Uh, we sell everything, right? Yes. Ones, two. The other one's pretty poopy as well. Keep the kinetic one, though. It's great. Be safe, friend. Hey, stranger. Hmm. Have to see you again. Point four life steal, or? A nice piece of oh, no. Sell it. You don't want to use that yourself. If you say stranger. Okay. Guess I should do a loot run here. It'll be easier because I won't go anywhere new. <laughs> I think I can eat spiders for charges here. Fourteen. Right? Yeah. What does repose do? So when you parry, uh, your weapon will glow and you'll deal more damage after parry. What's going on, Quickmer, by the way? 
Spider there. A wand. Yeah, that should be it. Hey! Hey! Don't die out there. Woo! It'll be really good for a quick knife. Um. I don't see why the speed of the weapon would matter, because parry depends on their attack rate, not yours. <laughs> okay, explosions. <laughs> well, we survived a hit, huh? Uh, shouldn't be able to continue the streak here. No, no cups. Any cups over here? No cups. There's a cup. <clears throat> Heavy weapon? Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess. I mean, typically when I'm parrying, I parry and then attack every time. Doesn't matter what weapon I have. But it is true that after you swing with the heavier weapon, you're more vulnerable. And it takes you longer to go to your parry sometimes. Actually, I don't even know if that's true. It's sort of true. <clears throat> is, I guess, what I'll say. Um, I'll grab this guy's weapon. I've noticed that, like, as soon as you connect with a swing, even with a heavy weapon, your parry is kind of ready already. Is kind of what I'm referring to. Oh, it's a dead end. All right. Oh, okay. Good. I was a little worried that the fire would. Uh, hurt me. <laughs> it would scale with me, not with them. Um, can I keep the win kill streak going here? Uh, nope. <clears throat> Those technical players? I mean, I don't know. If anything, you brought up the technicalities. <laughs> I, I mean, I don't know. Sure, I'm pretty technical. Maybe we're both technical. <clears throat> yeah, definitely a fair assessment. Don't know why I got defensive there for whatever reason. My apologies. Uh, so we're pretty much done with this floor. Have I hit that button yet? Don't know. I don't remember hitting the button. Okay. I did though. Well, I guess we'll go do a loot run here. Does it connect around? Doesn't look like it.
Hello. None of this is Hello. of any use, I don't think. Don't get killed. D don't get killed. That's my favorite. <laughs> That's my favorite line for the uh, for the shad keep. Is this a dead end over here? Yeah, it is. Okay. Just want to make sure. Heavy and sprint. Yeah. The sprint is. Uh, I've been having. I don't know. Maybe you can shine some insight on this, but. Often I'll like sprint at someone and strike at them like that, and it doesn't trigger the sprint. So I'm really not sure about the technicalities of the sprint. Like sometimes it triggers, sometimes it doesn't, and I just have no clue why it does sometimes and why it doesn't other times. But yeah, sprint and strike is definitely a very good strat. One of the strats I employ, depending on what enemies I'm fighting on, for sure. But I don't like really slow weapons. The mace makes me feel a little vulnerable. So this one's almost charged. One more spider here. Did I get the quest on this floor? I must have. Who go? Who knows? The game's new. And also, what does it post you again? So if you, I'll show you the exact description of it. You can find it. Preparing an attack increases the damage of your next blow by 19%, and you have a two-second window to trigger that. It's not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> oh, so much loot on this floor. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> This is my favorite one. I've had a gold posters. Makes me want to do an orc. Fire weapon there. I didn't think I could find fire weapons this early. Okay, okay. Gimme, give gimme. Give the weapon we have is stronger. Well, looks like we'll have to do one more loot run. I mean, we don't have to, but it is a lot of stuff. Stopper wands, I guess. Let's grab one more weapon. Oh, these are maces. Hmm. All right, fuck it. Pick, Pick our wands back up. Uh, are you mind showing all your leveled skills? If not, what does mind blow to? Uh, there is no mind blow, but I think you mean mind blast. Mind blast is a psionic attack. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's funny. I, I, I got a good laugh out of the skill because you think mind blast is going to be some sort of psionic attack or something like that, but it's literally when you chop heads off, the mind, the head explodes. <laughs> it's actually kind of, it's cool, if nothing else. But. Yeah, if there's any skill you want me to check out, feel free to ask. I'm welcome to, to share what info I have. Yeah, I'll keep these. This one's not so bad. Keep it. I think that's it. Yeah, 
we're finally... How much money do we have anyway? So we're pretty rich. Do we leave anything back here? No, nothing really important. We'll grab those, but... You know, probably not going to do anything with them. That's for sure. Do you think I need to level for my play style? Um, what are you saying? You like um, charging in? Or what weapon do you like the most? You like maces and axes probably? You like a slow weapon where you can charge in, hit, and then charge back out type thing? Uh, heavy blow would be a good one for you. Oh, I don't have it. Yeah, heavy blows is one. Sword to mace. Who knows? <laughs> yeah, I kind of like. I, I'm in the middle. I like swords and axes, uh, the most, and maces and daggers. I tend to not like. Daggers seem pretty weak unless you build into some sort of on hit effect. Like later on when on hit effects are pretty good, but I don't know. It's like uh, most of the time I don't go toe to toe with people. I just kind of. Hit and run. Hit and run or use environments. But <clears throat> one four three now. Should be still easy for us. Some traps, though. <laughs> An altar. Not really helpful. Yet. Hmm. I'm a little spooked by that room. Honestly. Wait, you got a shot on me? Oof. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I was scratching my scratching my wrist when that fucking thing came came flying into the room. They often don't. I don't know. They use, it's the the AI for those are weird. It's like sometimes they chase, sometimes they don't. I think we're just we're just gonna charge in there at this point. If okay, there's another one right there. That's good. Let's kill the spellcaster and the buffer first. Good find. Uh, Stop following me. Thanks for the follow. Oops. Why did that minimize? Gorkmer, glad to have you here. Shit, this went crazy. Bzz, sound, yeah. <laughs> Good old bag of loot. This thing, yeah, it's really strong for sure. It's very, very strong. Just kind of awesome that it is. Alright, there's uh, any ones we want to charge here? 14, 21. This one, I guess. Let's drop the stuff because it's gonna get cumbersome later on, anyways. <laughs> Spellcaster. Okay. Yay, head explosion. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. 
love it. Well, I killed both of them. <laughs> what the fuck? Does that head explosion scale with anything? Like it kind of looks like it does. Kill streak, no. <laughs> oh, I lost. <laughs> Cause it kind of one-shot those guys, which surprised me. Any loot in these things? It typically isn't. This is a big prison cell. I don't think I've ever seen a big prison cell like this. All right, it's in the corner here. Dead end. My favorite. More full it is. Ah, uh, yes, actually. <laughs> Not by default, but there's a, there is a talent where the more items in it, the harder. Uh, there's an improved sack swing, and with the improved sack swing, um, yes, actually, pretty hilariously. Actually, let's put the TK wand, TK wand here. Where are the, where's the floor trap for this? Must be there. <laughs> Try to get a kill streak going here. Vulnerable for a bit. I don't see how I can further my kill streak though. Easily, so whatever. I'll just I'll just loot. I think this run I'm gonna try to progress past level five. Kind of hoping I'd be able to hit him out of the air. Didn't happen. Ooh, ding! We have two skill points now. Let's see if I can't. Uh, Keep the kill streak going here. Oh, okay. Lost the kill streak. <laughs> All right, let's go back the way we came. There is some loot that interested me. Elixir. I haven't seen a permanent buff for a while. Stat buff, so it's good to find. Present for you, my friend. <coughs> Does uh, kill streaking seems ridiculously strong? You're getting two to three. Yeah, it's really good. It's really good. The problem is, it's like it's really hard to kill streak when you're not. Um, 
when you're fighting enemies that are, you know, oh, we're starting to get better potions. When you're fighting enemies that are, um, you know, not ridiculously, that you're not OP. Fucking, why can't I talk? God damn it. <laughs> So the key is here, above me. Let's see if I can spot the door. Oh, this door, no. Are you saving the ability points? Yeah, I'm gonna save it for uh, after I kill the spider boss. So after you split kill the spider boss, there's like uh, you can find some higher tiered skills that might interest us. Oh, there's a skull up there. How has he not tried to attack us yet? I don't see the door at all. Oh, there it is. So it's that direction. Okay, so I know where to go then. Uh. We go this way. Yes, this is the fastest way. All right. Are you gonna? Okay. <clears throat> Welcome to my blade. Enjoy your stay. That's it. So we have the key, right? Do we got the key there? Yes, yeah, so we could leave if we wanted to. I don't think there's much reason to farm at this point. Uh, we should fill up our inventory at least with loot. Wonder where those hammers are. Party. Oh, this I'm in the trap area. Burn. How did that hit me? See, that side swing always hits me, and I don't quite understand why. I'm starting to think it's a bug of sorts. Everything chat. <clears throat> okay, we got a full inventory of weapons now. You getting locked in here? Yeah, it's a glancing blow every time. I can't seem to get a perfect parry when he attacks like it looks like he's attacking just, you know, straight up sideways. And uh, for whatever reason. I mean I could experiment with this guy, right? Let's see. Look. That hit. I can't block that hit. That one's fine. It's that side glancing hit. I don't get it. Oh, we got. Maybe we're just not going far enough. I don't know. See that one? Why? Why is that not blocked? That one. I can't block that one. Like why? That one. What am I doing wrong there? I cannot figure it out. You got any ideas yet? I'll try to exaggerate it if I see it again. Okay, maybe I have to exaggerate the hell out of it. Hmm. Yeah, that might be it. I think I'm. you have to exaggerate the hell out of it. <clears throat> okay. I guess that's it. We learned. Cool. 
Alright, where's the trap thing on this room? It's right there. Wands that need charging? This one, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> Since we're here, might as well keep cleaning. Oh, I'm caught. If I can't aggro just one spider. <laughs> that guy hit me. It looked like he did for some whatever reason. You don't fight, bro. You're going for. You're going down. Wow, we have three of these orb things. Okay, we're definitely done now. Let's go this direction. Guys, don't fuck up my pathing and cause me to go into the hole, please. That would make me very sad. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> I'm not even going the right way here. One, two. I'm surprised that didn't hit me. It kind of looked like it connected right flat in my face. We're done here, right? Yeah, we're done. Let's go. Yeah, it's insta kill coda. Pretty brutal if you're playing permanent death. So we're not shooting here. Well, I mean, now we got to make a decision. Are we going to try to go beyond five? I mean, we could take the middle ground approach. We should throw some stuff down there. In case we get scared and we decide to bail out on floor five. I don't know if we really need two kinetic ones. Kinetic ones are kind of hard to use. Um, let's throw one down. I think that's it. Yeah. Oh, dearest of all my friends. Oh, that's a great piece. Oh, that's a great piece. Okay, I think that's it. All right, the pentagram axe. <laughs> so we got eight hundred bucks. Do we want to buy anything? That'd be a good idea. To... Oh, we have no boots. Our chest piece is pretty bad too. Wow, what happened to all of our good loot? Somehow we I thought we shooted a bunch of our loot. Did it? Did it get lost in the shoot somehow? I'm really a bit little confused. Maybe I just really didn't shoot that much. Hello. Hmm. Okay, we have no boots. Our headpiece is pretty bad. Our chest piece is... I mean, it's a decent amount of armor, I guess. No, it's not, actually. <laughs> yeah, we should definitely buy something here. <clears throat> I, have, I have no boots, right? The boots is a pretty good start, and probably this chest piece. What boots do we like here? Uh, range speed, mind blast, salt one, uh, melee life, da da, axe crit. Yeah, I like this one a lot. I'm gonna buy these boots. <clears throat> I'll probably buy this chest piece. Wow. Plus five in all stats. It's got whirlwind strike too, which I don't really like whirlwind strike, but. Okay. Don't get yourself killed. Shoot that. Benelvet chess piece or something. <laughs> Great name. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think I'm gonna try to progress past level 5. Now the big scare is, where is the next... Where is the Got next nice area? Tiger. Should probably buy uh, the rest and healing elixirs if we're planning on going very far. Go him, weapon's uh, kinda weak. Something to consider. I don't really want to buy a weapon, actually. I don't think I can afford a weapon. Uh, fire gun. Well, I beaten the game on uh, non permadeath. Beat it a couple days ago. Now we're trying permadeath shenanigans. <clears throat> Shoulder armor is all right right now, so I think the only thing we can do here is just buy a couple potions. Spend the rest of our money. Yeah, so we're kind of going all in get here him, get him, on making the next shoot, I guess. I could probably get rid of some of these fire bombs. Let's keep five. Throw two down there. And that's it. I'll use these things on the spider boss. They're not very good. Let's just dump them. Six. Let's put this here then. If I want to get rid of it. Okay. Head could be good if we can craft that. Headpiece, good. A headpiece is fantastic, actually. Our headpiece was absolute trash. <clears throat> Got a, a mace headpiece, which is probably good. Fortunately, we need to find a shaft. It's boots. That's also very good. Wow, we got like almost perfect loot here. We got like uh, we filled in our weak spots. Very good. Alright, any interesting traits? No deflect. I really wanted to learn deflect. Yeah, I don't see anything in particular. We should use our skill points at this point. Because it's going to be getting into a tough territory now. I'll, s I'll keep one skill point in hopes of finding deflect. Um, volatile and vulnerability. I don't know how good that is. 1% chance to be invulnerable for 3 seconds if you get hit. I mean, it could save your life, but most, most of the time it will probably do nothing. I do have a kinetic wand with full charge. Force Knight's an option. Being able to throw heavier objects will make kinetic wands, you know, more more versatile, which is kind of nice. Arcanist is good too because you get arcane wands all over the place. Mm -hmm. Then there's just stacking life steal. Maybe stacking life steal is just the best here. It's a boring pick, but I think it's going to be my pick. Uh, 
<laughs> Baby mode. Well, you're still very, very limited in how much you can carry. Oh, well, this short sword is straight up better than our sword. Yeah. Okay. Good fight. Oh, very well. What skill is causing our wants to not deplete anyways? Is it wand slinger? Oh yeah, it's wand slinger. So let's equip that one there. All right, let's go. <laughs> it just ain't right. <gasps> oh boy. Alright, we should not take any risks and make sure we stay at full health here. Yeah, let's go complete full health. Got a good stock of healing potions, but they can definitely disappear very quickly. So let's see if we can't make it to the next shoot. It's gonna be one hell of a challenge. Hey, grubby. Maybe I can melee this guy since he's so close to around the corner. Okay. Okay. That wasn't so bad actually. Oh! oh I got stuck on the corner there. As soon as I got cocky about doing that well. I'm like, yeah, yeah, we're good. Like, we have. Oh, there's the exit. Huh. I'm tempted. I'm tempted to just take it. The weapon's kind of weak. Hmm. I feel like I should at least get a weapon before getting out of here. This sword's okay. This blade's okay and all, but it's... Oh god, okay, I'm so scared of these guys. So what do I do next? Let's run? <laughs> Zip! <laughs> Poor guy. How did he get hit by that? Uh, Those guys do like 200 damage. I have 400 health now though. I mean, I think they do 200 damage. I got hit by one once. Would you call it cell shaded? Oh, I don't know. I don't know what I would call it. Eating a spider must be a lot of HP. Yeah, you can't eat the giant spider, sadly. Who knows, maybe daggers are viable now, at this point in the game. Yeah, what kind of on-hit effects do we have? I mean, we have... Only fiery blows and that's it, I think. No, I guess I'll do that, whatever. There's a quest. Do you like ranging these guys? Here, let's try. Can I? Oh yeah, you can. Wow. Huh. Yeah, kinetic wands are pretty good. Kinetic wands are pretty good. I mean, the fact that you can throw explosive barrels is kind of insane. Explosive. But I mean, if you miss your throw, I mean, fuck. Does that blow you up? <laughs> it very well might. <sighs> Alright, we're gonna get locked in here. Oh, spooky. Spooky, spooky, spooky. I was hoping to find a weapon by now. 
I mean, I don't know. My DPS seems fine. Do I farm this for or just go? Games you're looking forward to? Uh, damn, my character looks kind of badass. Um, I do want to try a game called Prospector in the near future. It's classic style roguelike. I mean, it's out. It's been out for a long time, apparently, but. Uh -uh. You know what? I think I'm just going to jump to the next fort. Is that dumb? I don't think that is dumb. I think that's fine. Wait, this is the sword. <clears throat> if my sword DPS feels fine, then let's just go. Whoa, 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 spooky. Alright. The large chamber was empty. It's a new record for Permadeath for us. The large chamber was empty, safe for the robed man on the throne. His head hung low between his shoulders and his eyes were closed. You quickly snuck up to the altar and crouched in front of it. Then you risked a glimpse past it at the wizard. He looked to be sound asleep. You focused back on the altar and whispered, Food. <laughs> That's what I was guessing. You would wish for. Ruins on the altar flashed and sparkled and not a blink later, the biggest chocolate cake you've ever seen emerged from the lights. Like a thought made real. Your hunger got the better of your trepidation and you grabbed a handful of the spongy goodness and stuffed it into your mouth. Only then did you notice the wizard's glowing eyes on you. Oh no. Shadow Empire. Let's just drop these here. I guess. Okay. So the sword is probably better considering we skipped the floor. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Back to platforming. You probably have to do this. So let's go and do it. Oh, come on! <laughs> the luck! Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, every time I fall in that room, I'm like, I fall right into the fucking spikes. <laughs> Weird, the save thing is right in the middle of the spikes. Can't say I've seen that before. Shadow Empire when it comes out next one. What's Shadow Empire? Never heard of it. I never heard of it. Oh jeez. I don't know what to expect at the end of the hall here. Let's see if we can't find a different path. Ah oh, fuck it. We'll be alright. Yeah. <laughs> 
So there's a shoot on this floor, which means there won't be a, uh... Which means... Well, let's use the map. <clears throat> yeah, so there's no... Um, reset. There's probably a reset on the next floor, I would, if I had to guess. We should probably shoot some gear, then. Is this blade actually worse? Thirteen forty one. Yeah, I would say so. Now, do we want to shoot any of our good gear? Because if we don't shoot any of our good gear, we're gonna lose it. Uh, because we're gonna reset at the next shoot, probably. I mean, maybe not. What if we feel strong enough to beat the game right now? It's possible. We might be able to go through the whole game right now. Without having a meta progress more. Because I was, what, level 20, I think, when I beat the game? So now is the decision point we can make. I mean, we can bail out and then refarm gear and stuff. The gear is, you know, good, but... Yeah. I think we're better off seeing if we can just win right now. It's possible. I think it's possible at this point. I think we're strong enough to potentially win. Shadow by is a deep turn-based 4x war game with a unique blend of military focus, sundry giant conduct, and role-playing features. Hmm, sounds fun. Kind of reminds me of uh, Tia. What's that game called? Something Tia. Just the way it's like, got role-playing features, I guess. I heard that guy hit me, I wonder. That guy's got a nice looking axe. One down. What am I gonna do about this guy? Just straight up fight him, I guess. Strangely enough, these guys are like, oh, you can actually hit him in the head with his shield on. Thing. Yeah, you can. Alright, that axe is a huge find. Golden tongue on it. Oh, baby. I do want to learn that, right? I mean, there's no reason to learn it yet, really. Because I have it already, other than a small discount at the shop coming up. I really want Deflect, but I'm going to get value from leveling it right now, so I think I'm going to do it. So Perma, Golden Tongue, first item is free at a vendor. That's like so good. Insane. It's basically like 500, 600 gold per vendor you visit. <laughs> there's a vendor right here. What a hilarious time to find it. Right. How does that mace head compare to what we have now? Yeah, it's a bit more damage, but. It's no, it's no good. We got a hilt here. I don't think there's anything else we want to sell. What a cool axe. Yeah, it's good. Oh, this axe here has deflect on it. But anyways, we just used our skill. We don't have the stats for that. It requires 23 intelligence. So we need to start stacking our intelligence a little higher here. 
So what's our worst piece and what's well, what's in here first of all? Nothing's jumping out at me. We just found a good weapon, so weapon doesn't help us that much. There's a gem. It's a decent gem. Fine bitches. I mean bitches. There's a wand that does insane damage. Holy moly. I don't have the intelligence to use it yet, but... And I won't for a while, honestly. I might buy this anyways. Ah, it's weird to buy this. Very weird. What about this leg armor here? This leg armor is a pretty huge upgrade. Probably gonna be that. Yeah, which leg armor do we like better? Quick Striker, Force Knight. Force Knight's kind of alright. Gourmet is pretty useless right now. Storm Tamer. Melee Knockback. This is Dex 5. Power Reloads. I don't remember what that is. Kind of shitty, I think. Mace Knockback, useless. Mind Blast. Alright. Pyromancer is. Okay, so what do I like better here? The 5 Dex is kind of good, isn't it? I mean, but so is the extra armor. It's a tough call. I think I'll grab the five decks. Those fucking traps behind me. I mean, the rest of the skills are kind of bad, though. Quicksilver is useful, I think. I mean, sort of. It's not useless. Force Knight. Oh, I'll grab this one. They're close. Hey, stranger. Hey, stranger. So sell this. Don't sell it or shoot it? Killed. Shooting it would be a good idea, I think. It's not too far. To kill people with. What else do we do? We can buy... We can spend the rest of our money on uh, potions. Or save our potions. Save our money for the next vendor. Next vendor won't be for a long time. I think buying potions is the safest bet. Let's just do that. Don't get yourself killed. Right. Um, let's go back to the shoot. <laughs> Those traps are pretty annoying. <laughs> Sorry, you guys were subjected to that. You don't see price until you pick it first. Yeah, it just says free. Square right. We'll go throw this armor in the chute here. Possible we don't reset anymore. It's hard to say. It's possible we're just going for a win here. We'll see. It's starting to feel rather confident we can we can potentially bag this up. Can we just leave? Let's find out if we can leave. The exit's accessible. It is accessible. <laughs> Do we just dive? Yeah, let's just dive. I don't know if it's a good idea, but we're doing it. Go on, eat up, child. You froze. It's a gift, the old man said calmly, his pale white hands still clutching the armrests of his pale white throne. At second glance, you noticed it to be made entirely of bones, as was of the furniture of the chamber. Only now did you realize you were standing in a remodeled crypt. The wizard raised his hand and the door behind you opened slowly. Take it and come back when you're ready for more, he said. You grabbed the cake and with both hands ran. Once you get under leveled, maybe real JJ. I'm not sure. My thinking, well, what's good is that we're on a floor where we can bail at any time. And if we feel like, oh, okay, this is ridiculous, then we can leave. The thing is, I have very, very good gear. I'm like, I got tons of blues right now. 
And yeah, we'll see. So I'm scared of spending if I I'm scared of spending too much time in this trap area because this Don't trap biome is Gerald. fucking annoying. Gerald. I think floor seven is the last of the trap biome. Yeah, so there is a reset shoot on this floor, as I suspected. Well, I should probably make sure I'm full health. That's tricky. Jesus Christ, dude. It's going vulnerable. Fuck it. Okay. That was close. I don't know if that guy would have one shot me, but we dodged him just in time. Alright, there's a bug there. The bug wasn't too scary, honestly. But I should probably just wand him to be safe. Hmm, I wonder. Wait, how did he... Did he just take damage from spikes? What's happening? Oh, he, oh, he just died. Or no, something died. Yeah. Let me see something. I'm curious. No. <laughs> I was wondering if I could throw a corpse at something. Doesn't look like you can. Fire damage from torch? Maybe. Oh, I don't know. Oh, it's missing. Oh, that's a miss. Right? No, that's a hit. It's hard to hit those bugs, they like sidestep a lot, see? Take so many shots. What's our best wand? Is it this, this wand? Okay. <clears throat> so we should try to clear to the shoot in case we want to bail. I don't know if we will bail, but having the option to is a good idea. The water shooting sound? It's great, isn't it? <laughs> it's so, like, I don't know, Harry Potterish, I guess. Oh, boy. 50 damage. Um. Really know how to clear that room. Can I range him effectively with this from here? Maybe. Ah, yeah, looks like it. Got nothing to throw at him, huh? Why did we lose that one? I thought I had one slinger. Well, I guess I lost one slinger. <clears throat> oh, 
drop the key. What else is in there? Nothing. Did he drop a key? Yeah, he did. Hmm. Well, we gotta go down there then. Best I don't go down there yet since I'm up here already. I'll get that later. Fuck, did I get it or not? Oh, God. What the hell is this thing, by the way? Oh, it's purple. A gem or something? I don't know what that was. Some dude around the corner there. Uh, it's a ring. Arcanist. Hmm. A ring has melee crit and strength. This has melee knockback and arcanist? I'm not a fan, honestly. I think I'd rather have my current wand. Uh, one. Clear room within 30 seconds. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> not at this point in the game. So, I, I did this already, right? Yeah, I cleared that. Um, I gotta go this way for sure. Gotta go to the left here. Hmm. I'd like to aggro just one of them. Cute way of handling them. Two, three, all right, no more. Weird, so last time I hit floor seven, I think it was floor seven, I'm not sure it was seven or eight. There was some crazy, crazy platforming I had to do, like non-stop platforming. This time, there's like not, oh, well, there's some platforming. <laughs> it wasn't, hasn't been as much platform. What just took damage? I don't know. Hey, for once we didn't get spiked on our way down. Isn't that amazing? Alright, 
let's wait here. Yeah, so it goes further up. Oh, it's actually activated now. Now maybe this is the same shit as before. So there's the, the bloody altar in the story. It's right there. It seems, at least it seems like it's that way. What the? What the fuck just died? <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. Am I gonna get locked in here? Yes, I will. Am I okay with that? Not really. Let's show a little patience here. Pretty comfortable down here now. Ding. Nice. Pure int. Yeah, we're kind of lacking behind on int here. We did get uh, denied some gear. Well, sort of. Oh, there's two dudes there still. Oh, a fire one? He's sitting in fire. It would be great to trigger that, but it doesn't look like I do. Hmm. There's a spike there. We can just spike him. One at a time, maybe? Would be nice. I bet I'll probably aggro them simultaneously. It looks like they have, like... If one aggroes, the other one will aggro. It's kind of cool how they're like standing there. Okay, we can donate some stuff. How's this component long blade look in here? It's not really... It's kind of whatever. I think we can get rid of that. I didn't like this ring. I don't know what you get for epics here. I got... Wait, I got a sword and a bomb, I think? Level 7 sword? It's a higher level than what we have. Level requirement. It's way less damage, though. Punch, yeah. Don't like it. <laughs> oh, an axe head? Uh... Nope. Two axe crate on it. Hmm. Intelligence 4. I mean, it has the potential to be better than this. Barely. With like buffs and stuff. So I guess we'll hold on to it. Like with all these gems and whatnot, it might actually be alright. Should try to keep our eyes open for artisan stuff. There's a smith on this floor too. We don't have a shaft though. We'd have to get our hands on a shaft. Let's get rid of this. It's only a shot of health for that one. I want to keep this flask of frost. It's a lot of damage. It's about the same as a firebomb. Yeah. Rather get health. 
Nope, no fall damage that I've seen anyways. I haven't fallen from super high, but I've fallen from quite high and took no damage. I think that's it. Uh, we can donate the wand charge thing, probably. Yeah. Alright, I think that's it. So, do we want to keep diving or do we want to farm this floor? Kind of feels like I should be farming at this point. So now we can reset if we really wanted to. So it's cool that we found it. I don't think we will. I think we're going to go for the win here. Mm, whatever. Let's hit it. I could have picked it up with a kinetic wand, actually. I should have tried, because I don't know what the range on kinetic wand is. Am I going to get locked, locked up in there? Oh, he got me. Didn't do that. Didn't hit me that hard, so that's positive. Get rid of these shitty potions. I could have just done this too. Last time there was a maggot in this floor, in this room. I wonder if it's. No, no maggot that I can see. Can I charge in there? I mean, I do like ranging those. Those slimes, they're kind of hard to hit, green slimes. Huh, they're on fire from uh, Pyromancer. Interesting. It was kind of a waste to eat those potions. It's only 40 health, but didn't need to. Live, playing hide and seek with me. Did you do it again? What the? F <laughs> he, I go to one side, he jumps to the other. He's gonna do it again or what? What the? F that's some weird. That's some weird shit, guys. That is some weird shit. Steam, folks. What the hell is that? I've never seen a cross guard that looks like that. <laughs> Less armor. Scare that. Starburst. Cross guard. Never Starbirth looks kind of kind of sick. Um, yeah, nothing interesting in there. Shot him? Shit, man. I 
won't get locked up in here. Is it? This could backfire pretty bad. Okay. Uh, nothing in here, it seems. charging thing. Uh, kind of sucks we use this wand a little too much. Oh well. We're gonna get locked up in here? We are gonna get locked in here. Oh, and there's a spellcaster? Uh oh. How do we do this? What do we do here? I don't know if I can take this guy down if he starts healing. He's not healing yet. We'll see how this goes. But... healing him. I don't know if it's just because he doesn't heal or what, but... Some man there. <laughs> Two of them up. Okay, he went down pretty fast. I'm not even sure what this purple buff does. I'm assuming it's more damage. Not, I actually don't know. Bye bye head. Kaboom! Right. Good. I feel quite strong. Which is a good feeling. Spikes here. Oh, the mage is coming after me? I guess because there's no one else here, huh? <clears throat> Melee crit 1%. Yeah, it's great, Ponsicar. There's a lot of that in this game. And. It's basically a, a like a massive focus of this game. Been in there already. Pretty much done here. This floor. Should be a few corpses we can eat to heal up here. There's also a, a random maggot on the floor somewhere. I don't remember where it is though. I think it's in that hallway. Maybe I should go look for the the one maggot that we saw. It's right there. Come here, you. I worked hard for you. Alright. Oh, there is an altar here. Is there anything else to donate here? This axe head might be better. This guard might come in use. I think that's it. Yeah. 
I think that was a crit. Kind of ranged crit. <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> I need to stop using my ward? What do you mean? My ward. Knocked him into oblivion. Honestly, if we don't make this axe head right now, there's no way it's going to be good two floors from now. So I could go sacrifice it. I I should do that. Where was it again? It's this way. I'm not sure when the next smithy will be. I think it's not going to be for a while. Am I changing biomes in this next room? I'm not sure. Damn, boys. Floor 8. Permadeath. Looking good. Um, I'm going to go grab some vendor trash real fast. That should be it. That should be this axe is a super good find. Where did you steal that, boy? Your father wagged his finger at you when, and then the, at the cake on the table. This is not the way a man solves his problems. There's a price for everything. He stormed off. After a while, your mother joined you at the table. The two of you ate in silence. The following night, you went back to the crypt. This time, you joined the group and waited your turn to be fed. For a fortnight, you returned daily. In a moment of quiet, you lay in your bed thinking. You noticed your memory had grown hazy. You didn't remember much of the last two weeks beside the sweet taste of fruit and tarts and bread and meat. Close your eyes and dreamed of the next delicacy you could wish for. In the morning you woke up with a headache and sore feet. Sore feet, huh? Then you realized that you weren't in your bed. You weren't even lying down. In your left hand you held a sack of coins. In your right a bloody knife. Hmm. Ah, oh, it is a new biome. Yeah, that's interesting. So the dungeon generation varies a lot. In our first time we went through that area, floor 7 was like jam-packed to platforming. I had to do like 3-4 platforming extravagandas, maybe even 5. And they were tough and annoying. But now this biome, things change up a lot in this biome. I think I should put my best potions on my toolbar. This uh, biome is, I would say, typically easier. Obviously, the enemies scale, but there's less traps to worry about. Um, and it's more combat-oriented. There's a lot less tricks, though. There's, like, less spikes in the walls and stuff. I'll try to use this to my advantage. I guess I'll just wand them. Well, how are we doing on wand charges? We got, all, we got a lot. We got this, right? So... Oh, improved sax mac. Uh, do I have a map? I do have a map. Let's use it. There should be a vendor up ahead there. An amulet with stats and improved sax mac. That is a huge upgrade. Let's take a look at this dagger. We're probably not going to use it, but 58 to 70 damage. It's pretty damn good for a dagger, honestly. The thing is, if you're doing power attacks, it's just the dagger is just not good. It has Artisan on it too. I should keep this forever because of Artisan. It's worth keeping just for that reason. If we ever craft something. And it's small. It's 
bike's right behind him? Yeah. Spikies. So let's try to head straight to the vendor. Speaking of vendor, if I'm going to the vendor, I might as well pick up the loot. Can I do the running cheese strat on these guys? Yeah, looks like I can. Oh, they attack pretty quickly. You almost got a swing off there. Okay. Why are you running? No honor. Shh. There's no honor in permadeath. Loot! I got a, a wand that is probably very good. Yeah, lightning wand. Goes better. <laughs> We're all playing our Buddhas, yeah. Shoot, huh? Hmm. A little worried because of that fire there. That's a miss. <laughs> I don't know. The fire has me a little worried. Can I fire? Can I bomb this? It did not. I guess I could just trigger the fire myself. I don't know why I didn't think of that first. But. Like the vendor might be this way. Hmm. I'm going to get rid of this tire here. Okay, let's go! Fuck! <laughs> Run! Abandon ship! <clears throat> Am I on fire? Oh, you're gonna float over that pit, aren't you? <clears throat> 
this point in the game, I am too scared to hang out around pits. <laughs> All right, shopkeeper over here. It seems found you. I'm so glad that you're alive. <laughs> I don't think I ever heard him say that before. I'm glad I'm alive too, bud. Very glad. Are we gonna shoot stuff? We should consider shooting stuff, actually. No, there's no way. We're finishing this run. We die. We either die or we win at this point. You know, I won't use that myself. I think we're at that point. That's a good piece. Oh, I wasn't supposed to sell that dagger. It had Erdison on it. Shit. Shit. Is this my only hilt? I thought I had another hilt. Yeah, I think it is my only hilt. All right. Keep it then. So our first item's free. I don't see any purples in here. Or uh, the other color. No one do for sales? No. Fortunately not. They should definitely add that though. <laughs> you can very easily make a... Uh, screw up your sales. Um, hell, instead of using the lightning wand, I should have used the telekinesis wand. Not a big deal. But So our first purchase is free. What? What? Could be good here. These mitts, thirty-four armor. Okay, that's probably it. Electrified strikes is fine. Wand slinger's not so bad. Um, that has to be the best purchase. Anything with deflect in here? Crumbling weapon. Never seen that before. Holy! Look at the damage on this. Ridiculous. I think what this weapon is is that it deteriorates and eventually you'll lose the weapon. That's my guess. Or the damage goes down. Because that's why the damage is absurd. <laughs> um, oh, there's a shaft here. I should probably buy the shaft. I shouldn't buy that first, though. So it's going to be this. I think that's for sure. Be safe. I got all your potions, a beautiful piece. See ya. Awesome. Oh, hello. Um. So the shaft, it's pretty expensive, 278. But it can open up opportunities for crafting on the next floor. I could wait till the end of the floor before buying this. That would make a lot of sense. I think we're going to do that. So we'll come back to the end of the floor. Be safe, stranger. Because our weapon is doing good work still, but I might get outdated in the next floor. I might. Skulls in there. Let's see if they charge at me down here. Yeah, one tricky thing about this floor is you never know if the door is going to close behind you. Guess we're just going in, huh? This floor can definitely kill me. These skulls. Okay, we're not locked in. We're not locked in. That's good. The fact that we're not locked in is a huge relief. This makes it so we can easily engage these on our terms. Surely you're going to charge at me, right? I was going to wand that guy that ran away because he probably was one hit from dead, but... You know what we didn't see at all? 
No. <laughs> our our trap dungeons or whatever we'll call it the trap biome. We, we didn't find like the skulls that shoot purple orbs, skull that drop poisons. We only saw one fire mage dude. I feel like we got easy an easy dungeon generation. We didn't get the crazy platforming. Holy shit, I almost just got launched into that hole. I ran up these stairs and kind of floated for a second. That was a spooky feeling. <laughs> Very spooky feeling. Is this a trap? I've never seen a weapon just lying around like this. What the fuck is going on? It's on strange flooring too. What? <laughs> yeah, I'm very, I've never seen that, so I'm like really scared. I don't like maces too much, but it's got starburst on it. Got way more damage, but it is a mace, but still. I think I use this. I don't know what starburst does, honestly. I think on parry it can has a chance to hit, which is pretty cool. Melee weapon is an animator with arcane energy. A hefty smack from the hands of evildoers may sometimes suffice to unleash it. 14% chance on parry to deal 200 damage. It's pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> Alright. What's going on over here? So there's the thing to turn off the traps. Is it even worth it? Like, why bother? There's a heal area there. Are we gonna get stuck if we get this heal thing? Oh no, it's this here. It's not really worth eating that food right now. Alright. Never seen a dungeon generation like this yet either. It's pretty cool. Let's give this mace a few swings. Just get a feel for it. This is not new stuff. There's a shoot. What did I say I want to throw down there? Nothing, man. I don't care. We're going all the way. We're going all the way. I threw a globe thing and just blew up in my face. <laughs> oh, purple. Hello. Way less damage, but it is a sword. Look at all those freaking things on there. Double gourmet. Yeah, yeah, we're using this for sure. Our first purple this run. Looks awesome too. I like how it kind of matches my my gloves, my chain gloves. Wait. Right. I got this kick-ass sword, and what do I do? Just kill them with spikes. <laughs> Vulnerability orb over there. So we can grab that and go gung ho for a bit. I was like, why is there nothing in this room? <laughs> Hi, dude.
pretty much wore off, so whatever. Didn't get much use out of it, but... Oh, here's where you climb. Oh, ah, that's what I was about to say. I don't know why that just triggered, but that Tara was fucking scaring me. I, I was about to say, yeah, why block? I didn't block, they were blocking. I didn't block at all. <clears throat> I was about to say, it's happened a couple times where Tara just spontaneously bursts for no reason. Like, I didn't swing my weapon or nothing. And I decided to go down to, uh, to get rid of it before I go up here. And as I do that, I don't know why I potion before eating these corpses, but... <clears throat> scared the shit out of me. It's a good thing I was ready for it, because that could have, like, surprised killed me. Would have been a pretty bullshit death. I don't know why tar things sometimes spontaneously combust. Maybe if it's just from looking down it triggers it, but... I don't know. I don't know, hope. not interrupt them there. So the interrupts aren't guaranteed at this point, it seems. Um, kind of going to have to go do a vendor run soon. Should do that now. All right. Let's go to the vendor. Got some stuff to unload. Still be careful here. These orbs could potentially one-shot me. I'm not sure. Purple orbs seem to do an absurd amount of damage. Hey, buddy. Over here, stranger. We're selling this, right? No, it's got golden tongue. We are not selling that. It's kind of hard to carry stuff. I think this key is not necessary, but... Actually, it's 6-5. Hmm. It's really hard for us to vent her stuff. I guess what I can do is... Um, I'll drop... I'll just drop any crafting materials here. If need be. Such as a sweet shirt. Hey stranger, you say so. How are we doing our potion count? Yeah, we're still doing pretty good on potion count. That's good. Um Give me that damn sausage. Give me. <clears throat> right here. I'm trying to figure out where to go. It's like it's here. Well, 
There's some purple skulls. I'm a little spooked by purple skulls, honestly. Mage. Hmm. Spooky. That's going to be a tough room. <laughs> Can I? <laughs> I got to try this. Oh! God, that hurt. Oh, Jesus. Half my health, so two hits, we're dead. Hmm. Is there alternative healing somewhere? Skip? I think uh, the key's behind there. I don't think I can skip that room. Alright, here's a full heal here. Yeah, two hits, or we die. That's pretty scary. I should really try to wand this. I don't know if I hit him. Forty-seven to sixty-four. Okay. <clears throat> got me real spooked. Very spooked. I almost got hit by an orb there, I think. Okay, he's dead. Good. So, all there is to do now, I need to run over there. Destroy that orb. Hope to not die. Hmm. It's a tall order. I wish I had that invulnerability orb. I guess that's what this is for. It was for tackling that room, maybe. You gotta be fucking kidding me with these fucking tables. Oh, that was close. Okay, okay, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Just gotta dodge a few hits. And we're safe. Okay. <laughs> the chair we threw kind of went against us. I should have kept throwing furniture at that guy, honestly. Um, it actually does a lot of damage if it does connect. Alright. We got through it. We got through it. What's scare? Jumping that pit or walking past this giant cactus? <gasps> Fucking the hitbox. I don't know what the hitbox is on that. It's... Yeah, there was something indeed. Ooh, there's a healer in there. Oh shit. Okay, heal that motherfucker. So we know there's a healer in there. He's trying to get to me. I wish he could. That healer might be super hard to kill too. Like if I go in there, I can be in big trouble. What up? But I don't have a choice. That guy's like stuck there. Okay. Now, where's the healer? Uh, 
back here. That's good. It's good that we've already done this because we know that this is a thing. Huh, interestingly enough, I could have lobbed something over, triggered that, and would have killed him. I don't know if it's always like that. <clears throat> did that kill the bug through the wall? Looks like it did. Nope, never mind. <clears throat> See? Come on, spit him. Uh, so we got the key, so we could leave. Well, we pretty much cleared the whole floor, honestly. So let's head to the um, vendor. Call it there. The stuff to vendor too, if we really want to micromanage our money, which we might, because we're getting close to the end here. I mean, that's an optional room. We don't really need to clear that, but maybe we should. Like, why not? Yeah, let's just clear. Let's try this out. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Panic is real, guys. Ooh, I wanted to throw, throw an explosive barrel. Okay, we're okay. Scary. Bad thing is, these potions had to be done though. Cause of death, giant cactus. Yeah, I got locked in when I tried to, um,. Tried to grab the explosive barrel and throw it. And I was full panic mode after that. I don't know why I'm trying to do such silly things at this point in the game, but. Because <laughs> if I throw a barrel and I fuck it up, I'd probably kill myself, right? We did get an invulnerability potion here, so we got our potion back. So that's a thing. I thought there was another dude in here. Yeah, there is. Hey, bud. There's that side swing again. Always seems to sneak by. Alright. Tons of loot, too. We want to grab all the loot, get as many potions as we can. Our potions are running low, so it feels like we should definitely try to get as much cash slash potions as we can. Because it would be hilarious, that's why. That's true, it's a flaw. That's true. Oh, hello. Guess we're keeping these wands. One charges might come in handy. 
Thank you for your business. All right, let's drop these wands. Let's go grab more loot. We'll do one last trip here. This room had tons of gear. I guess I'll loop around. Hmm. Well, all right then. So much stuff. I don't know how <laughs> how crazy I should go with the potion farming. Do you want to sell that one's beautiful. That is a lot of money. Great. It's like 34 each. It's like three weapons is a, basically a potion. Don't get yourself killed. Yeah. Maybe we should. Considering we're getting close to the end, it's permadeath and we're, We do get hit pretty goddamn hard when we do when we do get hit. I've already I've already been in here. <sighs> Somebody to kill people with? Thank you for your business. Over here, stranger. Have to see you again. Alright, what are we doing now? What do you need? So we got 1500 bucks all of a sudden. Wow, we spent almost all our money and that's all the way back up to this. Or did we spend our money? No, I don't know. Uh, what is there to buy, though? <laughs> it's mace. Be safe. Hello. I could buy his mace to see what it's all about. I'm actually not that interested, though. Um, just stock up on potions. Is that really what we're doing? This wand. Need 30 decks to use this wand. 76 to 141 damage. It's kinetic magic. Just cute. 540. Is there another shop in this game? Like, I feel like this might be the last shop. I'm not sure. I think I'm just going to buy a million potions. Yeah, let's just do that. It's a boring pick, but we're going to do it. Like, I think there's a shop in the final floor. But actually, yeah, I heard that each class has its own boss fights. So the boss fight's going to be something new. That's going to that's actually kind of spooky. I bet it's gonna be the wizard who gave us the the cake. <laughs> Alright. Don't get yourself killed. I mean we still gotta get there of course, but Okay, here we go. Run a voice whispered, you obeyed. You ran down the alley you had woken up in. Behind you, you heard men shout, There it is! You didn't look back. You kept running through the streets, instinctively taking turns as though you were... As though you knew where you were going. Finally, you spotted the door to the crypt. You glanced over your shoulder to make sure you had lost your pursuers and entered. You found the chamber empty. You dropped the knife and sack on the altar when you heard the wizard's voice again. Rest now, my child. 
close your eyes. So we clear floor nine, 10. So yeah, there's two more floors. Two more floors and then like a shop floor. And then I think the final boss. Two more floors, huh? I should really take a break at this point. Yeah, I think we're gonna, uh, I'm gonna take a break at this point. An hour or so. Home stretch, sort of. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna I think I'm gonna stop the stream this time, but all right, should I leave the stream open? Oh, I'll leave the stream open. It's kinda better for everyone. Yeah, I'll leave the stream open and we'll be back for uh back in half an hour to an hour. See uh see where this takes us. Been a fun run, I gotta say. Been a fun run. So we'll be back in uh yeah, back in a bit. Well, I'll put something on, some sort of re rerun or something, and we'll be back.
Okay, should be good. Damn, we got wrecked there. <sighs> Surprised that mole was hitting me. Usually if I dance around like that, I'm fine, but... I think I got kind of hung up on something and I, uh, I got stuck. Maybe it's too aggressive to play the moles like that. Yeah, I think uh, <laughs> I think we're going to do more of a try hard this next run and uh, not go wands. Not go daggers, just do what I feel is strong. Until now. Yeah, yeah. So anyways, we're back, right? Everything, uh, the stream should look fine once I start moving. But we just got wrecked. Yeah! Alright, let's try the undead again. Permadeath. So permadeath... Man, I don't know. Maybe permadeath no meta progression is just too hard. But we'll see. We'll see. That was our, like our first go at it, really. And we did a stupid build. And, uh... But it's going to be a hell of a challenge one way or another. Okay, let's go. Let's try something a little... This run will try something a little more... Um, we'll try stronger builds. But... <laughs> And we'll see if we have more success. We got pretty darn wrecked. It was pretty tough that floor like that first fight right out of the gateway They're hitting us so hard Like super hard In that run we actually did do a bit of um, What do you call it? We actually did do a tiny bit of um, Meta progress and we still got completely destroyed. We didn't do a lot It was mostly um It was a mostly naked, uh, non, uh, no reset run. I guess we'll call those no reset runs, what we'll call it. Let's try to keep the kill streak going. Let's be aggressive. Almost fell down there. That would have been bad. Okay. We're playing on dead characters. You can actually eat corpses. Fun, fun. You can squeeze in two hits, but strangely enough. Hmm. Guess what? The axe were too slow right now. Street going here. Kill streak? No. no way we could have went faster than that, really. All right. Nope, 
can see you here. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Janking out on me. <laughs> Alright, let's slow down a little. Grab our loot. Stream look okay now, friends? Thanks for pointing it out. Appreciate it. Alright. Um, I think we should go for a balance stat at the start. Um, just so we can equip most gear. Something like that. Well, I think all requirements will be five of something. So maybe we we kind of need to go five of something. So let's just give up on decks. And let's get intelligence to five and strength to four. Yeah, sounds good. Thanks, Souls. And company. All right, what room did we come from? Not that one. I think there's. I thought that I saw like a a loot crate, not a loot crate, but like a heal crate somewhere. No. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I thought so. <coughs> Camouflage. Oh, permanent strength. Some food. Um, yeah, we should eat it. For some reason, I can't trap that up. There we go. Hmm. Nice, we got the strength plus one to get the five strength. Cool. Um, no, let's go. Let's go to this door. Dead end. Is that not a perfect parry? Weird. I don't know. I wonder if rotten sausages are bad for the undead. Let's check. Yeah. Not surprised, of course, but. Might as well science it out, make sure. About the level, don't really need to eat too much. Street going here. As far as the man could see, and in a dangerous time where one by one they would awake, and the wind of them are striking them down as they tried to grab his head. Well. It's probably the end of our kill streak. Oh, maybe not. Let's see if we can't keep it going. Nice, got another one. It's a huge kill streak. Holy shit! It's the biggest kill streak I've had this year. Ten kill streak. I love it. Oh, we lost it. <laughs> Jesus. 
Pretty good to get a 10 kill streak, not without even having meta progression at all. We almost leveled up twice. <laughs> Holy shit, kill streaking is really. I don't know, did anybody notice how high my XP bonus got to there? I was too busy looking, but. I almost double leveled from that, just from kill streaking there. Kind of crazy. All right, now we have a lot of looting to do. <laughs> so downside of kill streaking, you kind of forget. You can easily miss loot that you've, you know, cuz you're just going around killing everything at freaking lightning speed. Over 3x? Wow. Yeah, we got mad XP from that. Obviously, you can't do that later on when it gets hard because you're just going to end up <laughs> getting yourself killed. But um, Yeah, let's not explore anything else that's backtracking. The man, the especially this guy's loot. So the exit's here. Let's drop any vendor trash here. Probably a wand or two as well. <clears throat> I'll switch to a sword. Nah. I think axes are one of my favorites. Axes and swords are the two that I kind of like. Um. Okay, let's go this way. Okay. Spike two enemies at once three times. This is probably the worst quest to get. It's pretty it's super hard. Probably get yourself killed trying to complete it. It's just the wrong way here. Kind of almost down this floor. The secret area. That's pretty much it. Oh, it's a treasure room. We got mace knockback innately. Considering I don't like maces, I'm pretty unhappy about that. <laughs> pretty unhappy about Gat skill. Steel, armor. <laughs> Look at this sword. It's like a foot for as a handle, a bone foot as a handle, and a super rugged. The starting gear is hilarious. It's some really funny shit. Oh, I almost missed that ring. I almost missed both of those. Uh, melee crit's pretty good. Yeah. Probably gonna need to spend my stat points soon. We'll do that. I mean, might as well do that now. There's no reason to wait. Um, I think may life steal is something worth investing in. It'll be pretty good later on if we're going melee build. Well, I mean, so I'll probably just do that right now. It's pretty kind of near useless early on, but.
All right, folks, we are back. Thanks for hanging in there. Got some food in me. Are we ready to die? So, uh, yeah, so. Okay. The beginning of the floor is just like the pit. The beginning of the floor is the scariest because you don't have much space to work with. No enemies that spawn though. So that's always a good feeling. Leveled. <clears throat> Skill points. Something like that should work. Again, I kind of want to save a skill point for deflect, but yeah. Guess that's what we're doing. Do I have a map? I do have a map. Let's use it. Okay, there is a chute on this floor, which I expected. <clears throat> so we couldn't bail out if we feel like we're getting our ass kicked too hard. This will arrange this. Arrange the bug. <clears throat> that was a big hit. Holy shit. Two hits. We killed that thing. We got a crit, but. Little green ooze on the ground is worrying me a little. I count it as a sprint bonus? Well. Dodgy bastard. <laughs> you dodgy bastard. back and okay right yeah okay check check yeah still live twitch chat we good alright trying to get the damn sword Take a look at this helmet. Spectral blades might be worth strength or armor. This looks like an upgrade. Yeah, I would say so.
cool looking helm of the abyss. Where's spectral blades? So worth specking into this? Hmm. Nah, I'm still gonna save my skill point for deflect if we see it. Get his attention. Okay. Glow on the dark pommel. <laughs> it's got starburst on it. That's cute. <clears throat> got a little spooked, took the damage, popped a pot, and we got twenty pots. We're kind of okay here. Should we aim to go somewhere? I mean, we could... No real goal, honestly. It didn't lock us in. I didn't think it would. Another just sword lying on the ground here. <coughs> Fiery shots? I don't think I've ever seen fiery shots before. That's deflect. It needs to be crafted. And I can craft this with a hilt, I think. I did buy that hilt, didn't I? Yeah, no. Was there a hilt? Yeah, okay, it's right here. So I could craft this just to get the deflect. I don't think the weapon itself is going to compete with what we have right now. Um, but that op just having that option is good. The hidden door. Alright, well, we don't have the code for this yet. Ooh, a wand recharge. Hmm. Do I have Spell Slinger right now? I do have Spell Slinger. Good to know that's there, I guess. That's the exit here. Another weapon over here, I guess. Oh, it's a chest this time. head. That weapon's going to be so hard to replace. And that mace head... Where was that mace head? Here? 247-337? No. I like the sword better, still. <clears throat> so this is the machine gun one we just got, right? So, this is the secret door. Let's save just in case. A 
Another wand charge? Or is that the same one? Whoa. Whoa. I thought I was been in I thought I was in here. Ah uh, shit. Got me. Oh, that miss could have been bad. Big crit. I guess I'll turn this wand. Might as well. It's a nice wand. Um, might be hard to find a better wand than that anyways. The machine gun wand that I have, I don't know. They're kind of... I haven't used them much, but they're not... If you don't feel very good. <laughs> Smithy? So I can learn deflect now. I think that's worth it. Like this weapon we're not gonna use for sure, right? No, I've already discerned that, so Let's see what what's fiery shots? I don't think I've seen that before. Uh, oh, actually, I've seen this, yeah. Your shots will be enhanced with fire at regular intervals, dealing 15.9% damage. It's pretty good for wands, but we don't care that much. We want to learn deflect, for sure. Good. Skulls. <laughs> Eating every creature you see. Well, we're, we're an undead character. That's our character. We're undead and able to cannibalize slash eat anything. Relatively safe from that orb shot. A purple shot? I don't know. I think it has the potential to one shot me. So I'm very scared. I'm not sure. No, you guys aren't going to charge me? Okay. These skulls hit very hard, too. Easy to take down if you're ready for them. Oh, well, we're locked in. Okay. Let's go up top so I'm safe from the trap. Interrupted him. Interesting. I didn't expect that to interrupt this charge. Okay. Good, good. Another clean room. So we can turn that off over there. Do we want to turn this off? Probably. 
It takes a while to turn that one off, but it's also above a pit, which worries me a little, not gonna lie. I gotta say guys, I'm super on edge with this run, just being this deep into it. <laughs> it is uh spooky. A death would be very devastating. And like, it's a very real thing that could happen. There's keys in this room apparently. I feel like I should stop farming though. I feel like with every room I do I I do the the more challenges there are. So we can just straight up leave right now, and I think I'm going to. I don't know. We're so close to the end. Fun to watch. I'm glad you're enjoying it, Benoit. We're so close to the end, but like, you know, if we keep fighting, we have chances of finding more gear. We also have chances of dying. I don't know. But we're, and at the end, there's going to be a boss that we just don't know what to expect. So being as strong as possible for the boss could be good. It's not like we're struggling that much, I don't know. If I could light up that tar he's sitting on, that would be nice. I wish I had a fire wand. Finding a lot of potions right now. It's back to where we were. I haven't found the code yet. Is that what that red dot is? Let's not forget we have deflect. Wait, what is this red dot? Was it that book or what? Yeah, okay, it is the book. Still haven't found that code though. I'm actually not even sure how to progress right now. This code must be hiding somewhere? What? Does that book have numbers on it? No. Zon the Powerful. Hmm. <coughs> Gotta use that thing too. Yeah, I, uh... I don't know where to go from here. <laughs> Before, the codes were always inside of some sort of uh, closet. I haven't seen any closets yet. Walked into those spikes. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we just get out of here. Maybe it's in the pit. Maybe. Well, whatever. Let's just leave. Let's go charge up a wand here. I don't know which one, but. Wait, where? Where is it? Right there. 
Alright, this one's pretty much charged. That one's missing five charges. I guess that's the best one. Just gonna use the blade oil now. Could have potentially saved it for the boss. Maybe I should have done that, but... I don't know. Inventory issues as well, sort of. Okay. Well... Skipping. You opened your eyes and found yourself still in the chamber. Only now it was crowded with your comrades. The wizard was addressing his flock with an eerie chant in tongues you did not know. Another blink and you stood in a burning village. You heard screaming from the buildings and watched people being chased down the street by zombies. You blinked again. Now you were towering behind a noble woman brushing her hair. When she looked up and spotted you in the mirror, you cut her throat. A moment later, you were back in the crypt. The wizard sat in his chair. His men stood in a circle around a visitor. Alright, this should be the last... Oh, wait. Oh, shit. This is it. This is it, boys. I thought there was one more floor, but no. Oh, dearest of all my friends. <laughs> is it just me or is my mouse acting up? <laughs> it would be a shame if my mouse acted up at the last floor. Uh, oh, I gotta change my batteries to be safe here. <laughs> so these two swords are pretty much the same. Um, yeah, the sword I have has blade oil on it, so I guess I'm happy I used it. There's this armor here. We don't have the intelligence for it. Twenty nine intelligence. One intelligence off. Ah, no. That's bad. Does it give intelligence? It gives intelligence. If I could craft something, I could put this plus two int on it. It would have to be a sword. Uh, this has int on it. Is that a blade or is that a recipe? It's a component, yeah. I've only got 169 bucks. So I can only buy one thing, actually. Hmm. Can't really buy anything here. Thank you for your business. Is there anything you like? I like a good price. Yeah, the sword's good. I'm keeping the sword. The only piece of armor is this. <laughs> There's no... I can't see a way... I don't see a way to... Um, equip it. So there's literally nothing to buy here. <laughs> Other than potions. Wow. Okay then. Okay. I mean, I don't know 100% if this is the last room, but I... It's, it's, it is, right? It's gotta be. So, yeah, let's just, just sell everything. That's not a bad one, actually. For the most part. 
Let's make sure I don't do something stupid and accidentally sell this. Okay, well, we're fine. Let's just... I'm pretty sure this is the end here. I think. Why did it look like there were 12 floors? Not 11. Hmm. Man, I'm scared, everyone. I'm so <coughs> scared. Can't believe we made it. Not gonna lie. Can't believe we made it. Trying to think how to prepare when I, I'm trying to blank here. <sighs> Can charge this up. Machi machine gun wand. How many charges is one thing? Okay, so one thing is a is more than one charge. I wasn't sure about that, but yeah. Okay, I'm gonna change my mouse battery. Am I? God, is it working fine or is? How dumb would it be if my mouse just died? I don't know. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Stop pissing yourself. Is it gonna be a different fight? What the? No, it's the same fight. Something must have gone wrong with the ritual. Thanks. Ava, kill it. Same fight. Okay. Well, same fight. That's something. It's an easy fight. Okay. Except when you get hit, it's not so easy. At least you can't get some. Now you're truly enraged. You'll never be able to parry. Don't you do anything stupid you doing down there? Stop. Find where I can see you in the Come back and find where I can see you. What are you doing down there? Thank the gods this balcony is held aloft by these two steps. At least you can't get to me. Okay. I'm perfectly safe on this sturdy balcony. Now you truly enrage her. Take that! I'm having a hard time parrying. God, time out! Tampering with my balcony. Maybe this Stop isn't it. going as well it's as I thought. I don't think I was hitting well, it there. At least I'm invulnerable up here. Maggie did it. She's angry. Gods, time out. Come back and fight where I can see you. What's going on? This isn't going too well, is it? Can I range her? I don't even know. At least you can't get to me. How's that not a block? I'm perfectly safe on the dirty balcony. You won't like her when she's angry. Now you truly enrage her. Don't get any ideas with those spikes. Fight where I can see you. It's one. Thank the god this balcony is held aloft by these two stout pillars. What? This isn't going too well. Why am I not blocking these? I'm so confused. At least you can't get to me. I'm perfectly safe. Okay, let's just go invulnerable or something. You'll never be able to parry all those blows. Don't get any ideas with those spikes. What's going on? I'll see you down there. Come back and fight where I can see you. Can I push her? I wonder if you can push her in the spikes while she's getting her shields. She's angry. You'll never be able to parry them. Don't you do anything stupid what's going on? Looks like there's some things about this fight I don't fully understand. Well, at least 
time and vulnerable up here. <coughs> now you did it. She's angry. <coughs> Don't get any ideas with those spikes. <coughs> well, at least I'm vulnerable up here. Come back and fight where I can see you. Well, at least I'm vulnerable up here. I think I'm safe up here. No, at least I'm invulnerable up there. This isn't going to you. I think I'm safe up here. Let's try the machine gun for the fuck of it. This isn't going too well, is it? You think I'm safe up here? Thank the gods this balcony is for these two I don't know how this works. Shit. We use a lot of potions. <laughs> I feel like I was doing either I was over tuned last time and I didn't care that I wasn't perfect parrying, or I had the talent where perfect parrying deals less damage. So are we gonna rescue her this time or not? Let's not rescue her this time. Well now we're undead, so it's gonna be a different ending, maybe? I don't know. Oh, crazy wand in there. I don't know if you can do anything with the spikes in that fight. Because, like, if you if you knock the sword out of her hand, sometimes she goes close to the edges. And maybe you can pick, hit her while she's... Hit her while she's gathering her sword. And the boss says something like, Oh, what about the... Don't get any idea with the spikes. Yeah, I don't know. What about just chop that balcony under invulnerable points? Huh? Oh, invulnerability potions. Yeah, that might work. I mean, I've only had four left, so... I was being, you know... St um, stingy with them. You open the heavy door to freedom. Beyond them lies another set of stairs. Leading to a narrow bridge. Once the bridge, you find yourself facing a column of 20 men of the Royal Guard. At their helm stands your command, Lord Baron Stoyle. So, that's what finally ended him, he says. Lord, shall we kill it? I suppose so, Stoyle. Go on, them. With a sigh, you draw your weapon and head into the fray once more, wondering if there could even be a future without bloodshed for a walking corpse such as yourself. Let's see if the game crashes again. Yep. <laughs> uh, we did it! Holy fuck, guys. We beat Hardcore. I mean, permadeath. That's basically one of our first attempts uh, with resets. Well, actually, that was our first attempt with resets, really. Without resets. Fuck it. Seems so hard. It's not. The game's not really made for that. Um, that was hype, man. Stop following me. Uh, uh, <sighs> Thanks for the follow, Oyan Oyanari Biri. I did my best. Do we not unlock another character? How the hell do you- I'm gonna have to <laughs> spoil to figure out how to f unlock the other characters. 